Are we real? Are we here? Do we exist? Or is it all just a fantasy? Oops. Oh, Raze is already here. Here to raise it up. Okay, now that everything's all set and ready to go, Seamus has mouse control again, so he can't screw anything up. <laughs> good relevant Tims of day. To all the Tims, good relevant. <laughs> Hello to all Tims. Especially Tim Kosing. to the Tims. It's tool time with Tim Allen. <laughs> What time is it? Tool time! <laughs> Let us all begin grunting. I don't think so, Tim. <laughs> oh man, I haven't seen the show in a long time. But I, I've watched a clip or a, a YouTube video of all the individual clips of like, Tim blowing things up in the workshop or at home with his DIY stuff, just everything going off the rails. Oh, that was, that was pretty like good. Like, show. yeah, that... I feel like that show can't hold up though. <laughs> probably doesn't, but <laughs> it's pretty problematic. I think probably chauvinistic and stuff. Oh, well, all I right. Just like seeing it stuff blow time. up. Hmm. Is it time or is it Tim? I think it's Tim. It's Tim time. It's Tool Tim. <laughs> All right. So on Thursday, you were able to defeat England four. Three. Three. You did England three. I did England three, not you. I, I did England yeah. three. England Sorry, isn't suggesting... too bad. Sorry. England isn't too bad until level five. Hmm. All right, well, on that note, let's do England 4 then. It's not too bad. <laughs> not bad at all. <laughs> England 4. And for formality purposes, hello and welcome to Spirit Island Saturdays, where we play Spirit Island, and I am Lou Dolphin, and these are Migrant P and Seamus Butler, and blah, yada, 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 you know the routine. Let's just get right to it. <laughs> So yada, yeah, yada, yada, we're playing Spirit Island. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want to play it too, you can find it on Steam. It is no longer in early access. You know what's also no right. longer in early access? Factorio. It just got released in 1.0, like earlier this week. I heard that it's been early in early access for like four years or something. Yeah. No, I've never no played about it, ten. Ten years. Ten years. <laughs> well, I, I yes. think it was, I want to say it was like 2013 or something that it first came out. But I don't know. It was a long time ago. It's been there so long, but the devs are just fantastic. Yeah, it's one <laughs> of those games that, like, it's been an early access, but it's been an active early access. They kept adding new stuff. Like, once they got to version 0.17 a year ago, it wasn't so much new stuff anymore. It was about updating the visuals and the UI and and uh, fixing bugs. Like, they're pros at fixing bugs. Someone reports a bug, they release a new version in, like, two hours. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I mean, we could probably keep all of our games in early access for a long, longer time too. But like, I don't know. It's kind of a marketing thing, really, as opposed to anything else. Uh, what was also in the 1.0 release of Factorio was the Spidertron. Spidertron, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's been the running joke for at least two years, and it's real now. And I did not expect it's real, it at and all. It's really good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've seen videos. I haven't actually played it in uh, like a month or two, but I've seen videos of it and it's ridiculous. It's like, it's a really, it's not just like a meme thing. It's actually has great utility. It can, you can send it out to build blueprints without you having to actually be there. It's great. Anyway, we're not here to talk about Factorio 1.0. We're here to talk about Spirit Island 1.0 and England 4.0. England 4.0. I have chosen a board, and with it, a spirit has arrived. All right. A lightning. I'll take it. Trying to set up for the uh, 
three player layout. It'll automatically do it if you drop the new board around top. I was reading through all of the instructions for Spirit Island. Oops, someone clicked on Excel. Ex my Excel opened up. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, that was possibly me. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. He at least didn't close the stream by accident. Tonight uh, it's Spirit Island spreadsheets. I, um, I played physical Spirit Island last night. I was talking to John and Seamus about this, but... I played Physical Spirit Island for the first time last night, which meant that I was rereading the instructions, especially for setup, because I actually had to physically set everything up and be mindful of, like, you know, not That's just true. where the Dawn and towns and cities go, but also the with the um, branch and claw and jacket earth stuff I needed to know about beasts and the um, strife, I disease. think. Disease. No, not strife. Disease. The disease token. Disease, yeah, disease, that one, yeah. And I just had to make sure I was dotting all the I's and crossing all the T's. And even though it was a difficulty zero game, I had to, like, I felt I had to make it difficulty zero in order for me to make sure that I did everything correctly. <laughs> because, you know, when you say I'm going to defend four in this land, you actually have to remember that you're defending four. And then you need to have that effect expire, which just I forgot it, to just do. Just write it on the, on the land with the Sharpie. It's fine. I used energy tokens to represent defense, <laughs> but then I forgot, like, the next turn to remove the energy tokens, but... There's spirit tokens in the game for that. Right, yeah, but yeah, they don't tell some... you, like, what that effect is. It's just a reminder, and you're in a big, complicated game. It can be hard. Yeah, and I wasn't sure, like... But yeah, there are little tokens. Yeah. They only give you, like, three uh, of each color. I wasn't sure if I'm supposed to, like, put one on the board and one on the card I played or something to link them up that way, or just leave it on the can. board. You um, can. If you're having difficulty remembering the um, the defend, use a dice. No, I was using energy tokens for the defend, so it wasn't like... I was yeah, the, the issue wasn't forgetting the defend, it was the forgetting to clean up the defend, really. But, I mean, it wasn't that I accidentally defended on a next turn. It was more just like, all right, so what's happening on the board? Oh, this still has defense tokens. I got to remove those. <laughs> all right, anyway, enough talk. I'm going to put in land D. Oh, and I completely... D is for dolphin. Screwed up what Seamus was going for. I'm just going to take this board off. What do you mean? No, no, I don't you have to be specifically there. Okay, fine. You don't you have to be specifically there. Fine. You didn't change anything, Lude. I don't know what you're talking about. It moved Seamus to the right. No, it's in the same spot. It just rotated. Oh, is this Seamus? No, it's not Seamus. Seamus took this guy. Seamus is on board B. He's still on board B. Yeah, but board B was below board C. And Okay, doesn't matter. Um... Let's see, I did England with lightning and ocean last time, so I don't want to do ocean just because that's going to uh, be a rehash of that. <laughs> um, well, you've got river now. I have river right now. Do I want river? Um, yeah, I'll just leave it that way. That's fine. I feel like I play River a lot, but River's good. Well, your stats, your, does your spreadsheet say which spirit you played? <laughs> yeah, uh, from uh, two months ago. <laughs> haven't updated it <laughs> since. Okay. <laughs> yeah, River is great until England 5. We were talking about that on Thursday as well. Because yeah. invader pieces having extra health means that the two damage to each invader... Uh, innate becomes less effective. It still does great damage, but you need to do extra damage to take out towns and cities. Yep, but that's a problem for most spirits with the exception of ocean and lightning. Which were the two spirits I played on Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> Should have saved them for England 5. Whoops. Oh, well. This is good. All right. I think we're good. All right. Sorry, board A, you're not coming tonight. And they're starting in the wetlands. Yes, yes, you fell for my trap.
Boogsy is a fan of Lightning River Green. Well, hopefully we can live up to your favorite trio. Ooh, uh, yeah. John, those added um, starting uh, mm -hmm. things are very pretty. Mm. Yeah, those are from the thematic board. And uh, we were just going to have them show up on the thematic map, but then, like, without doing anything, they were on this, too. And we're like, oh, that looks nice. Let's keep those. <laughs> and Eric's on board, so. I noticed it on Thursday, but I wasn't entirely sure what it was. I don't think I noticed where Oceans was. Yeah, we didn't have a graphic for Ocean at the time, but we have one now, so it'll be in the next version. Ah, gotcha. So that helps version, differentiate is... whose board is which, I believe. Yep. It's mostly just a nice little visual thing. But yeah, but it'll it shows up on the board of the... The, the starting board for the spirit in sort of their main starting land. Mm -hmm. Or and only there's... starting land in the case of two of these spirits. <laughs> <laughs> and there's another thing that's been added and I will not spoil it until it pops up. But we saw it on Thursday. So if you're here on Thursday, you saw True. it. But... <laughs> okay, so building in wetlands and I'm starting in a wetland. And there are, well, if we can go do fast things, there are at least B8 could be stopped. And the end. <laughs> I think that's because C8. Of the, oh, it's C8? Yeah, I guess it's C8. Yeah. Uh, yeah the B8 one the is jungle. Um, okay, right. But the, yeah, the one at the top next to me, I could stop the build with a power storm or a raging storm, which is a very expensive way to do it. Now, I can't really stop the build in D3 because of the uh, England rule, but I could probably just push the town away with wash away or an innate or something. Um, yeah, just push it into the ocean. Right, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I I'll probably about... just take care of the town in C5 after it gets built. I'm not sure about what I can That's do like in D1. I could save the Dahan with River's Bounty. But the stereotypical River Start is take two yeah, presents. I mean, you could try to get a defend card next turn, but I don't know if it's worth slowing down for that. I'm doing Wash Away and River's Bounty. That also gets my innate. And then I'll also have the innate next turn with Boon of Vigor and Flash Floods that can maybe also oh, yeah, stop a build if it's not terrible. Uh, do I to rush to reclaim one? That what we should be doing with River? Hmm. I mean, you can do what makes sense for this game. What makes sense for this game is I want to be in all the all the wetlands, but probably not D1 right away. So what is this? Range 1, range 1. So I can get to this wetland like this. We just need to make sure that we do something about that. <laughs> Alright, anyone else want to take okay. a turn? Or is everyone else just going to skip their growth this turn? <laughs> I'll just, yeah, skip growth, do nothing, play, play no cards. If you skip skip, do you draw an additional card? <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering if it's worth it to Raging Storm that land. If I Raging Storm... I can also destroy the town and have, like, a really poor turn soon. But, uh, it's Please remember, I'll be throwing extra presents space your way. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> I'm gonna start moving down this way because loot isn't, so someone has to. And anyone who wants to go fast can go fast. Also, so you could do a fast wash away loot, for example. Indeed. 
Might be good in land six there with the where they're going to build a city. Yeah, stopping that city build. I can't stop the build altogether, but I can stop the city build. Six. And then it's easier to get rid of that town next turn. Or you can also push it with your innate. Well, yeah. I'm just going to completely dick around with England this game. It's like, oh, you have six towns in here? <laughs> well, I'm going to move them everywhere else. <laughs> you could block a build in the south by wash away and then massive flooding the town in the jungle, potentially. Indeed. So then there isn't, there isn't two next to it, but. All right, are we good? I'm good. I am. I'll okay. finish playing our cards. All right, All right, I'll do my Who fast wants... phase first. Done. Well, would you <laughs> until like I get fast power? Until I get booned. Or would Green want fast powers? Is there a? Oh shoot! I can't Seamus. actually save the Dahan and D one because I can can't oh. gather in there. Oh well. Range zero, I keep forgetting. It is range zero. It's not going to change my plays. I just have to reevaluate. All right, I suppose I am proliferating. Uh, Keep going down. I think. Uh, I can push Don. Yes. Yay! Saves a lot of hassle later. And. I'm going to just send one of these to Han out of here. Into here. Guess I don't need to do that now. But I may as well. There's not really any difference. And I will save Thunder Destruction to the slow phase. Oh, can you just throw all enveloping green somewhere? Oh, right, defending. <laughs> there. Lou, do you want to use any fast? Yeah, we want to stop that city. Yeah, you could either stop city or you could stop a town. Or stop a town at all, if you wanted to. Stop the right. city. In Are you six. blocking that city build with the uh, presence? Yep. Oh, okay. okay. Then, yeah, you could clear the wetland by using both powers there if you wanted to. Or you could, I mean, you could just save Wash Away to the slow phase. That's. I mean, yeah, I could move maybe. that explorer um, into B2 and then the explorer in town into B1, and then this doesn't build. Yeah. It's not a bad idea. Are you going to do the defend 2 next turn on B6, Seamus? There won't be a town there next turn. Oh, you're going to get rid of it entirely. Okay, so I don't need to move Dahan there then. All right. Well, I could still do something there to take out the Explorer, but... All right, so then I will not use that one because I want to push one with my innate and then two with this one. Everyone, into D1. It's party time. <laughs> And lightning's on its way to give you the pyro. <laughs> All right. Hey, two builds blocked. Three builds blocked. Prevented. All right. 
They'll be Mountains coming eight. round the mountain when they come. So oh, it's just that one town that could see that mountain in the middle. Yeah, that that's we could prevent that really easily. Well, I could, but well, I could flash floods it next turn. I guess. Good, but you used your cards already. Yeah, but I still have flash floods for next turn. Spiteful damage. <laughs> Ah, yeah, the town was moved. Why don't we take this town and move it somewhere else? Yeah, so I could get the Dahan into B6 to destroy that explorer. Or into Mountain 7 for striking back against the next Ravage there. Uh, yeah, Seamus, if you had to defend to next turn, Lude can have Dahan there instead of moving that town which would just blow them up on the Dahan, right? Yeah, that's what I was asking about, but it's fine. Because um, you could, like, destroy the town in C7 instead, or push the town in C7 instead, for example. Yeah, I can do that if we want to work why. I guess, yeah, it will, as long as you'll have the defense next turn. Because I think that's probably the only useful spot uh, yes, for it. Yes, because I'll, because I'll be reclaiming next turn anyway. Yeah, so that's like the okay. only useful spot for it. So, and he can go somewhere not that wetland, probably. Because I'm, I, well, I'm destroying a town now, and I could destroy a town there also. Well, it could go wherever, basically. <laughs> Just move it away from the middle. <laughs> yeah, away from the middle, probably. Closer to the coast. Even though we don't have ocean, coast is still best. Because then I can gather two. Maybe one out of the wetlands is gonna. Oh, yeah, get... probably should, yeah. Or might not get, be getting killed if he's putting Sacred Site there, but. Yeah, that's not going to ravage. Right, so it might as well just come out. But actually, yeah, he might as well come out anyway because he won't strike back because there won't be a ravage. Alright, so then the All Creeper's right. Tear that does nothing and a Thundering Destruction left over. That does something. That does what I want it to. Yay! All right, so reclaim one rush. I actually get to reclaim one immediately. That is the idea. Ooh, I get to River's Bounty again. And I would get my level two innate. You that... wouldn't have be able... I guess, yeah, you can afford Flash Bloods if you don't, if you play the zero cost card. Yeah, so that's interesting. So... These, uh, these wetlands are so far away! Um, where do I, where should I go? I guess this is Danger Land. Are you going to have uh, Lightning's Boon again? Uh, I can. I I'm could... going to have one energy and four card plays. Two energy and four card plays. Luxury. <laughs> I, I could I could save the Dahan and move them into D two or D five. Let me see. I guess you're gonna yeah, if you're, cost, that, you're, you're gonna that gain a power one card energy. anyway, so you might as well yeah. gain that power card first. I would like to play Shatter Homesteads, but if I get another one energy or zero energy card that's worth playing, then I can boon ya. Okay. And save the Dahan and use them for so I go back and then you can do your thing. Right, yeah, because I am reclaiming and gaining a card, so I will gain a minor power. The first draw has my elements in a nice card that costs zero and prevents builds sometimes with this adversary. So that is good. Visions of Fire Doom does that too, but you have to, it's range zero. This range on this is so good. Um, yeah. 
Is that is like that in lightning's other. progression? Because I think it's like it has lightning's elements. So it I might be, assume. yeah. Or is it shadows? Maybe. Yeah, it could be either. I haven't played with the uh, lightning power progression ever. I think I played with rivers power progression, and then ramping greens power progression, and then I just started deciding to draw my own power cards. Because I want well, that more looks like one for your elements. <laughs> <laughs> And also, both River and Lightning love getting minor powers. Oh, you're not gonna get that defend, right? So you don't have the additional card play? Oh, right. Hmm. Well, I mean, uh, most of the Dawn will survive and kill them. You just lose a bunch of presents. <laughs> Unless, uh, yeah, you don't have enough energy to overgrow. Sorry, can we rewind? I can actually get enough en energy to do the overgrow in the night. Oh, right, right, yeah. Unfortunately, that means John doesn't get another presence to play. Ah, That's all right. I see. So this ravage is not going to happen then. Is that the thought? Yeah. That... Okay. So um, you're preventing the unless, leaves. Uh, yeah. Unless uh, you can throw a defend in there, which I don't think you have. I mean, I could gain a power card and maybe get a defend, but that reclaim one is sexy. <laughs> yeah, I think that's fine. Yeah, no, that's fine. This is how green works. <laughs> I mean, if I take a power plants. card, I can still work towards it. Plants Except die and plants next grow. turn, I wouldn't get it. So, yeah, I want that reclaim one before I start getting in a. Well, I guess if I get in a reclaim loop, then a reclaim one does nothing. But the goal is to avoid reclaim loops. And reclaim one that pushes off the reclaim all. Uh, right, so I could save the Dahan here. They're going to build in D5. So I think I should be able to blow up that town in the fast phase next turn. Oh, so you will. That should okay. be. Yeah, I can make a sacred site in C4 and reach it. In any case, not I mean not in any case, but in the case that I would do that. <laughs> well, you're not getting that so, sacred site this turn now. Not this turn, but I can get it. Do have it next growth. turn? Okay, got it. Or by card play, yeah. So I don't have to get myself so you, in there you can have or get a play. sacred site closer. Um, I mean, I yeah, I you might as to well go there to have to do rivers bounty there, right? Yeah, it's either D two or D five, but probably D five gives me better visibility overall, yeah. so it's probably better to just go there anyway. Tier two Level and two. eight. Oh, I could also just blow up the town and be six if I can do it fast, but. Uh, yeah, you could use your innate here as well to stop the build. Oh, yeah. Like, or you can use your floods. innate. You can't use your. Oh. You can use flash floods here, but you can only use your innate here because it's sacred site range one, right? Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. Let's do that, and we'll play probably those two next turn, so I can destroy town, 
this turn and boon you move to Han. I don't have to play that this turn, but it probably makes sense to destroy a town this turn. Uh, there's no diff. Well, if I, yeah, I'm going to have it either this turn or next, so it doesn't really matter. Looks good to me. So Boon of Vigor is happening on John. Bam. Yay. That way you That's actually good. can play your two cards. <laughs> I'm happy. Yeah. I mean, I would do the plus three energy, but I'm, I don't have to now. So that's good. <laughs> oh, oh, right. That, that option. Well, I mean, you're always going to be energy starved. But now I can put two presents instead of one. Yes. Sweet. None All right. Lightning's floods. boon goes to river. Right. So then oh. Seamus is going. We'll take the fear, Alex. Actually, that's a question, John. Four of Go in a Night, why doesn't you just click on the uh, presence on the card and it automatically puts it in the land you've selected? Um, because that would be different from how you normally place presents. Okay. <laughs> Right, so this is happening here. The Han army, we need a thunder speaker. <laughs> <laughs> or a minor power that uses them. So if I. F this build oh, is going to happen. Don't block, you don't block enough builds there because there are towns yeah. nearby. So I can't flash floods here effectively. And I could flash floods here effectively if this town weren't here. But a town is there. Can I? I could I massive lure, flooding it, though. I can lure a town away. I could also oh, you just could, destroy yeah. the town here, though. I could massive flooding there. That's true, actually. So, Seamus, you don't necessarily have to overgrow there, because Lude could kill the town in six and then let the explorer die by the Han. Potentially, right? If I did that, we could stop the build in B7. Right. Yeah, you could flash flood that guy. Yeah, if I flash floods here and then massive flooding here and throw that guy wherever. No, leave him there to die by the hunt. Uh, don't throw that guy wherever. But we might want to go back further if, yeah. if that <laughs> means that Seamus would if want Seamus to overgrow If Seamus wants to somewhere go somewhere else, yeah. What do you think, Seamus? Or, even, or even play different cards. But... Yeah, I'd go back to the original plan of um, uh, Gift of Proliferation there. Okay. Yeah. So we'll just don't click forever, but click back right. a little bit. I will <laughs> click until it says finish playing cards. There. Yeah, then just rewind that overgrown tonight and play whatever else. Yeah, I think we didn't see that we had a solve for that build, so... Lightning's Boon is what gave that, so let's give that Lightning's... Oh, okay, sure. All right. Uh, do I need anything this turn? I don't think I can do anything really important. Basically, I'm going to lure this guy away so he doesn't build. And Harbingers somewhere, maybe, if needed. And this is range one of a sacred site. So I guess if I make a sacred... I'm going to make a sacred site here so that I can destroy one of these towns in the slow phase. It's my sacred site. I'm actually like, this is weird for lightning. Like, usually it's like... Sacred Site, Sacred Site, Sacred Site. Four Sacred Sites, all good. But uh, I've not been moving that way. So let's go on the energy track for right now. Boon. So go ahead now, Lude, and boon. <laughs> <laughs> boon for boon. Boon for boon. All right, and then do this for the Dahan safety. 
and then and dot on baby. this town and not push the explorer and flash floods there. Nice. Okay, so this guy is doing that, so I'm gonna lure this guy probably to the sands up here. I guess he could go to the sands here, which is by the water. It's a little better. It's not really near our stuff, but it's close enough to me. Ah, uh, you know what? There's enough range zero powers that I might end up grabbing that having him there is probably better. And we want to have Dahan here. I don't have Dahan there, but I can't. Oh, this is push Dahan, right? So, but I want to push them in here once there's a town and there isn't yet. So let's just wait on that, I think. There's no Dahan we need to save or anything. So let's keep that for the slow phase. Warning. <laughs> You're being smart. Warning. <laughs> I'm just reminded of Kevin Malone in the office. There was one scene where like, um, they were trying to do something secretive without some of the upper ups noticing. So Kevin's like, we need some kind of signal in case they come out. And someone's like, we don't need a signal. We're going to know when they come out. And then Kevin's like, warning, warning. <laughs> 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 oh, Kevin. Yeah, he's great. So I think we're probably destroying that presence, Seamus. But that is your call. Yes, we are. Either you destroy the presence or you destroy a presence and get a blight. <laughs> it's up to you. I mean, if we're going for adding blight this game, then we could just allow it. <laughs> build, 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 build but not everywhere. That was only four builds, which is exceptionally low for England. We stopped two of them. Keep the center clean. That's gonna be tough with the jungle. <laughs> A lot of jungle in the center. We skipped all one explored. explore, yes. Oh, they did, hey, down there, right? In the bottom V8 right. was not explored. Oh, damn. That's excellent. That's actually, and we're not gonna have a high immigration build in the bottom wetland, at least. Or the top wetland. So there's oh, two, right. high, yeah. there's two high immigrations two. we're not getting, so that's really nice. We will get one in uh, the bottom wetland because there'll be a town in the jungle. Yeah, that's what I said. Well, there's only two. There's the bottom number three and the top number eight. This one is not going to... We know there won't be because the, the, the town nope. gets built in jungle two later. Yeah, the wetland build is first. This is only having one adjacent city, so that's yeah. not happening. But the wetland this six will get building. a build. This is building. This is not building. So yeah, we have... Oh yeah, and this is going to build too because of these guys. Yeah. Unless I am booned again next turn, but I think your plan right. wasn't to do that, so... So I... Yeah, there's still two cities here, so... I'm not going to be able to stop the build here just by killing one of them, one of the towns. So I think destroying towns over here is the way to go. Uh, so just making this sort of a no op for them. Let's push. Uh, probably one of these guys because I'd rather have these guys closer to the stuff going on in the jungle. And I can destroy that other town in the uh, fast phase so that those mountains are taken care of. And you'll have to take care of yourself there, Lude. Well, we'll see what you draw. <laughs> yeah. And we can get the Reaper's Tower to Mortal, it's only one damage. Actually, maybe I'm going to go back because having, t if we can't deal with that, I'd rather have two Dahan there than one so that they can at least kill the town together. Well, one of them. Yeah, we'll skip Reaper's Tear. That will be doing something soon. 
<laughs> it combos well with lightning. And with uh, river. With your beef. Or, sorry, that when I said lightning, I meant river. <laughs> I mean both. Crazy I mean, yeah, you have combos. the one damage to each. I have two damage to each, but yeah. I was thinking of river. I was being selfish. But actually, all right. so, for all of us. Speaking of, go ahead, river, and reclaim. Okay, lightning. I don't have enough energy for a major, and I think it's... I would like to... I always like to start with a minor just so that if I do get a major that I really like in addition to my base cards, I would like to keep my base cards. They are okay. really not... Like, all of River's base cards... I guess Buna Vigor is not the best, but with multi-spirit games, it's pretty strong. Yeah. Buna Vigor is great! No water cards. <laughs> you are very thirsty. And one sun... I know it has sun and earth, so that's nice, at least. Right. Only one fast power, so I can't necessarily deal with uh, with D5. But yeah, so in that case, I'll blow up the town there and let the other one blight. Yeah. So we don't get a cascade. That's fine. Uh, I mean, gift of constancy is energy and yeah. reclaim one. Instead of I like starting. that. And it's your elements. Yeah. Welcome to being the support hero. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Because <laughs> the other ones, like, I mean, push up the two towns is nice. Gather three, push three. Dahan is nice. Shadows is a bit hard to use because range zero and only mountain jungle effects. Having that card with Mountain on it is nice because that means you don't always have to be playing Wash Away to get yeah. to your top. And it's energy zero, which is kind of necessary. So if I want the two damage effect, I need to play three water cards. But if I don't want the two damage effect... You need to play four water cards. No, the... Oh, you mean... Oh, the tier two, middle two effect, damage. Right. Yeah. Um, so lightning. So I'm gonna to kill that town. D5, yeah. So I don't need to worry about that. Uh, this is. Yeah. This is. That's lighting. happening. <laughs> Building in the jungles. This is danger jungle. This is. If I destroy this explorer and you take out that town, that doesn't build. If I use flash floods. Yep. So that doesn't build. That does build. That's building. And you could wash away a lot of the other problems. And that mountain two on board B won't be ravaging. Oh, you're going to block it? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's just a question of... If I do Gift of Constancy... I mean, Gift of Constancy plus Reclaim 1 is I basically keep my hand except for one card. <laughs> All right, yeah, so... Yeah, and you can help Green... You can help Green out. You wouldn't give it to me probably this turn. You give it to Green. So that Green doesn't have to reclaim as quick. Yeah, because you're reclaiming you, next turn you no have to what. reclaim no matter what. Yeah. So yeah, that's just gonna go to green. So I guess, yeah, I'm not gonna reclaim one, so I'll be able to hit this threshold basically no matter what. But if I take a river's bounty, I can keep my energy flow going. Like I'll just be, I'll just like I'll just play river's bounty every single turn. That's what this game is, okay? Yeah, I mean, if you can play flash <laughs> floods every turn, it's expensive, but it's pretty strong. So. Yeah. Being able to play it is nice. So you don't get your second and eight, but... But I will next turn. Right. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead then. Yep. And one of these days, you're going to get to two card plays every turn. <laughs> or, Maybe this day. 
three card plays this Our turn. Plays. <laughs> combo, c -c 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 combo. Hours. Ooh, are we blowing up a city? Are we? No, unfortunately, it's only a town I can kill. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh no! Wait, I've got second yeah. level. Yes, I can kill that city. Yeah, the Ooh. mountain city or the jungle city you could kill. So uh, it'll be the mountain city because. Um, there won't be a jungle city. Oh, you're going to block that? Cool. Yeah. All right. Fancy. I, and I guess I need to grow. Come on. Where did my mouse? The mouse disappeared. Now it's at the bottom corner. It was in the upper there. left. It disappeared and went to the bottom <laughs> right. teleported. I guess there's so a I wrapper. Can... I dropped my mic. <laughs> I guess there's a wrap around where, like, you go up too far up left, you end up bottom right. Oh boy! So I'm gonna go for the do oh. mic drop. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> mic drop. All right, sacred site choosing time. Somewhere in the middle of all this jungle, I actually am in the middle of the jungle business already at range one. So I'm gonna get close enough to help with this jungle business. by putting a sacred site right there. It's actually nice that the sands are just like safe to put presence in and not worry about it getting killed. Uh, cool. And let's play all, all of my cards. Actually getting some energy generation, which is nice. Thanks for that green. <laughs> you are most welcome. All right, so Gift of Constancy is happening to green. Thank you very much. And then we're going to flash floods this guy. All right, go ahead, Seamus. Oh yeah, is there a place where defend four is gonna do anything? All the mountains he can see. <laughs> yeah. Not being able to talk while uh, I've got control of the mouse is annoying. But no, there's no way. Oh yeah. Four is any good. That's weird. That is this still happen. the case right now with the new mic? Yes. Uh, um. Ooh, what I might do is just turn off push to talk. Oh, yeah, that's oh, probably it. I see it. what you're doing. Yeah, if you're using push to talk, right, then you press your push to talk key and it goes to Lude's computer, right? <laughs> so you turn on my push to talk. <laughs> yeah, I don't use push to talk, so that would be the solution. Uh, all right. I have mouse. Do I? So, now testing, I can uh, talk while I've got control of the mouse. Yay! Alright, this town needs to go. And Raging Storm could... That won't stop a build there. It won't. I just played it. Did I need to play it? I might need not have needed to play it. Uh, kill the Explore in Sand 6. What for? Uh, future proofing. I, I mean, they're gonna build in the wetlands, in C five, and then they're gonna build. Or no, wait, no, so sorry, they're not building the sands, it's the mountains. I mean, I can I can hit an explorer with it on this slow phase, but I don't know if that's worth the three energy. That yeah. basically, if I don't play it this turn, then I could. Um, have more play energy it next for your turn. reclaim turn. Yeah. Okay, one back. Yeah, I just clicked on it, but I don't. Unless there's somewhere that 
it's useful for like green's ability as well. Like I could uh, deal a damage to this town and then you could finish off the town or something like that, right? Potentially. But if you're yeah, using your I'm ability. Gonna eat a city. Yeah, you're gonna eat a city instead. Yeah, I think I should just not play it then. Sorry, I'm gonna go back. We'll have to redo. I will redo oh, all those things to the best of my ability. So when is there going to be a Sentinel-style undo where it has a list of actions that you could rewind to? <laughs> I mean, that would be, that'd be very hard because it's uh, not as not straightforward like action, as start like, of turn. Yeah. The idea is like you could at least like click and hold and then be able to go back like back to the end of this phase or whatever. Oh, uh, okay. So at least like you'd have like a granular, sort of uh, at least a way to jump it to a spot that's not. And then you don't have the issue of like how how many times should I click? John's just saying that because he's pissed at all the times I undid too many times. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, really. All right. Oh no, a blight! Kill town. Yeah, in my in my physical game last night, I think my island blighted on turn three or something. Um, yeah, I think we're blocking this. Yep. But the blight effect was you get to play another card and gain another energy during the growth phase. So it was nice. Except for the event cards. Uh, uh, yeah, block that build. Oh, wait, okay. sorry, I've been talking. Sorry, you can I, talk I, and do it. <laughs> yeah. A whole new world. <laughs> A whole new world. A dazzling yeah, close place. Your eyes. <laughs> Escalation time. Now we have to this be mindful now of the Aladdin sing along stream. <laughs> um. uh, oh, they're exploring in the sands. Finally. So I'd say put the guy into the jungle in that one. For the escalation. Uh, otherwise, uh, you'll get a second city in the sands. That is true. The jungle's gonna ravage, but that might be a write-off up there anyway. I mean, I'll definitely be able to kill all of that in the fast phase, so maybe that's fine. <laughs> um, if that's where I wanna focus on. My decision was made for me. It's danger wetlands. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's uh, getting close to losing wetlands also. Yeah. It has five buildings. So two more escalations, and that's the, the lose. Well, I could get to my tier three and eight next turn, I think. Maybe? Maybe not. Uh, so I just realized I can't do the stem of flow of fresh water. Oh, you don't oh, have a sacred range site. on a sacred site. Rip. Yeah. Do you want to maybe do that in the jungle instead? Uh, no, I want to keep that um, that uh, place somewhat under control so it doesn't become another potential capital. Sure. Yeah, because they're going to build a city there with the escalation, so... Does anybody have use for another minor power? I certainly do, because I need I have five card plays and would be certainly ready to play Ooh. more. We don't. I don't have overlap with either of you on elements, unfortunately. Uh, that's a shame. Um, yes, you do. Is, I mean, or yeah. It's water. A <laughs> tiny amount of a tiny amount of water is a, is a thing. Um, no major I, overlap. Actually, I, none I of us great, have major overlap. Right. Sorry. I was I was just gonna say I have I had great success with Elemental Boon on Thursday, but that's when Lightning didn't have it, but Ocean because then I had Lightning with four card plays triggering the tier three, four, and eights. Right. So yeah, it's actually not good for Lightning to have it. Um. 
You could take it, I mean, and then I... I'll just go for major powers where you could swap the major or swap the power cards in hand. <laughs> I could certainly take it. Uh, nature's resilience is pretty good. I like um, nature's resilience. That 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 makes it so like. Call to bloodshed is quite good as well. Yeah, I like call the bloodshed. I like nature's resilience. I mean, I like boon as well. Yeah, um, we also have Dahan armies that we can use, especially with my uh, constant rivers bounty. Yeah, the big army here with no one in it. That's a... <laughs> <laughs> well. Uh, they are gonna build there next turn. They are. And I can move to Han, and it has fire on it, so that's not too bad. I could use that along with uh, harbingers to like bring to Han in here to blow up stuff. Right. Um, for example. That's not bad. Yeah, we don't have the Dahan like in the places where they're ravaging now. Like the jungle just doesn't have Dahan in it generally. Yeah. So the defend is not as good. So let's go with Call of Bloodshed. I mean, unless you can really give me a case for Elemental Boon, but I think the only element I want is water it's very rarely. So <laughs> like that I would give you as well, so. Yeah, I support Call of Bloodshed. You support Bloodshed. You've heard it here first. <laughs> Lou Dolphin, a big fan of Bloodshed. He calls for it, in fact. Just out of context quotes. <laughs> but they're the best quotes. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Right, so how do I solve problems? So I'm basically... You can get a town out yeah, of I'm a... I'm going to go for four uh, card plays and two energy next turn. So I'll have like three energy four? plus one oh, you, is four. You can't see B4. Yeah, I'm just thinking out loud, but I'll be able to play all of River's innate cards, which will give it River's base, in, like, tier three innate. Um, right. But most of those are slow things, unfortunately. I can make you fast. If you're gonna, if, yeah, if you're gonna get boon. I will probably most likely play boon, and so I can let you, like, if you have one more damage, like flash floods, you can then also kill the city, right? In right. D2. I was actually thinking of getting that so I could clear out the wetlands a bit better, but yeah, stopping the issue in D2. I could also just let this blight, sacrifice this but clear the wetlands. Well, if you send the explorer in D4 into that jungle and kill everything in the jungle, they don't build in the sand there. True. It's not a bad idea, potentially. Right, that stops that build and stops us from having to deal with it in two turns. Um... Yeah, so I don't need Dahan to be in D2, then. You took Call of Bloodshed, right? So should I start yeah. grouping things into D1, maybe? Or do you want them to Not be somewhere else? Not too many else? grouping. They have five already buildings in there, so... Well, yeah, that's why I was trying to deal with that. Or oh, you think of using your big innate on that land? Yeah, that's what I meant, was I was going to use it here to... I thought he's on two jungles, cities with town yeah. one. Oh, it's also coastal. I would, yeah, I would actually clear the wetlands next turn if I did this innate fast oh. and then flash floods the two cities. Sure, then you could save. That I mean, if you're sexy. reclaiming, you might get a defend for D two, but. Oh, I'm not reclaiming. Yeah. Then get get the guy at D two. Then I'm reclaiming oh. one drop power card from hand, and I'm reclaiming one, so I can right, get right. all the cards I want. <laughs> well, D two is gonna ravage. Then, right? So you could save the guy in there. Yeah, that. I think I just have to sacrifice this, but everyone else has been taking Blight, so I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, well, I guess I let D1 Blight, so I already, I already dipped in that. But right. yeah, I got to save this guy. We're going to clear this land, and. I guess. You put Dahan this... in D4 then, right? Yeah, that's the only other place that would do something. Um. Yeah, leave the they're army. Gonna, they're going to build there. Oh, you want to leave the army? They, yeah, 
take the guy from eight, there's nothing happening there. True. Because okay. I have a card that's really good with big groups of Dahan, right? So yeah, having well, I mean, them all together. Well, there you is... were just saying that we have a Dahan army, but can't do anything with this. Is why I was saying let's try to move some of those guys elsewhere. But it's fine. So I'm gonna push this guy in here. Oh, what? Well, they're gonna build there anyways. But sure. Oh, true. Right. Like you said, you were gonna blow up D one. I, I, so I, I, I got stream crossed. I got stream crossed. Why not move stuff into D one? Uh, why don't I move stuff into D one? If you're gonna blow so, it up, then. So assuming we blow it up, because if I just let this build, that's terrible. <laughs> but as long as we have lightning's boon and I have my four cards, it should be fine. Yeah, like doing that, we do have to blow it up because it'll escalate into there. We lose. Yes. <laughs> So I have to, yeah, I have my two base cards here. So I have to take one of these cards now, and then I'll need to take the other one during my growth. And it has to be this growth so I can do four card plays and have enough energy to play my hand. I mean, maybe not the two energy part, but I do want that two energy. So now this land is actually safe. And still want to try to get, you know. Living on the edge. Do I I probably don't want to be in the in the sands, though. <laughs> well, I mean, it lets you bring Dahan there. If you're there. True. Okay, I'll do it. It's a risky plan. Sad. The only card in your discard is Gift of Constancy. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we call irony. But yeah, so if I do massive flooding fast, and then flash floods on the two cities, then we take out danger wetlands. Yeah. And we also get two, four, five, six, seven fear off of that. We get a fear card for the first time in the third or fourth round or whatever it is. <laughs> Our first fear card. Not playing a fear-based game. I think the only fear has just been the few city buildings we've blown up. Yeah, we don't have... Played it. I, guess I guess I've generated a little bit of fear with Harbingers. Yeah, you do have that fear card, but... And so does goes one Green. Fear. But Green's been placing presents like a boss. The only thing to fear is not enough fear. Living on the edge, oh. escalation from game over. Yeah, D7 could be washed in. And that would stop the city build there. Nice. I like it. Living on the edge. No, I can't. One more town will end it all. I can't. There will be seven town cities in there and we lose. <laughs> Yeah, don't, I don't push like anything it. more into there. Don't I don't do that. like it. <laughs> Ray's just wanted us to escalate the game to defeat faster. I mean, you could, you could, you could destroy them all, then wash away the stuff from seven afterwards. That's fine. Yeah. Except it's still gonna, still gonna build though. So at least it stops the city. Unless you deal with C four. I could also just like blow up towns and things. That's a thing I do. You need to apply C4 to C4. I'm probably blowing up C1. I just haven't looked at what I'm doing yet. I am gaining yeah, a power okay. card. Okay. <laughs> Frenzy is still sour about it. Yeah, my one defeat. My <laughs> one defeat. Could take a major. But I want, I'm going to play five cards, so I need more miners. I'll take a major next time. Ooh. Rain of blood. You just love Call of the Dahan ways too much. It's my favorite card. <laughs> <laughs> but I know it doesn't have your elements. We don't need Dahan. We have 
we have me playing uh playing um River's Bounty every single turn. Hmm. I like enticing splendor for the Dahan gathering. Indeed. We need more synergy. I also like that it's free. It has air. Good. All right. You want to be booned or we lose the game. So let's do that. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I could take out a town with flash floods and we could just forget about blowing everything up in there, but no. No. Just no. All right. So my thought was dealing with C1. I guess I just need to kill the buildings, and I can just do that with my innate at level 3. Oh no, I need my innate at full to deal fully with that. Yeah, and I get my full? I don't have enough water. You don't have enough okay. card plays either. Yeah, I only have four total. Oh, right? oh no, you have five, right? Okay, so I four have plus five, one. but I don't have enough water to get there. So I definitely want to play this to get at least to the third level. And then I want to. Oh, I could play. I could also destroy a town with this. So yeah, my goal is to get this without having to use Dahan. I can use the Dahan here or here. Because if I kill all the stuff here and kill these guys, they don't build, which is nice. Yeah, and they. Do build here though, unless we kill one of these towns. You want me to kill like this town? Oh, there's, there's well, so much. It just towns. has your presence in it, is why it's I was thinking so you want to do C4, but it's. I mean, oh, yeah, they are if, ravaging there. Yeah. Yeah, if you took out C, the town in C4 and I used uh, Wash Away on D7, then we stopped the build in D7. That was. I mean, just I can one just thing. gather it away. Potentially. And I just need another fire. So not that, but one of these. Yeah, I do need to blow up. I don't want to lose a presence there, probably, so... Question is, will Call to Bloodshed do enough? I guess Raging Storm I can do here. Kill all the stuff here, then they don't build there. Uh, right now, I'm just, oh, well, I will destroy the city and the town and then shatter homesteads for the other town. And then Lure the Unknown gets rid of the town in here. I can like put it somewhere else, somewhere else, anywhere else. Weapons one. Hmm? Wetlands one. What? I think he's saying can... put it down here. I cannot teleport it across the board, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> I think he just wants there to be seven towns and cities in there. <laughs> I think he's the mole. Yep. Uh... Actually, if the Dahan kill this guy... They won't build here. Right. Unless I lure in the wrong place. But I can lure... Can I lure them... the right way? I need enough fire. That's the problem. So I, need, I do need to play... I could play this, but not that, and then that. No, I just... Yeah. I need I need this card because I need the fire on it, right? I need five fire. You need yeah, all so of I, your cards need to be fire cards. Yeah. You can't use I can't Tyson play Splendor. Tyson Splendor. So I have to play this. So I basically need to use Lure to get this town out of here. I mean I don't have to have to, but I want to. 
And what so, does enticing splendor do? It's just yeah. I mean, it would let me gather away. Yeah, but actually, I guess it would because I'm not in the right spots for that. Because it's not no blight. Yeah. Yeah, right, you're turning so. a town destruction into a town gather if you played that. So I don't know that that's necessarily worth. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna blow up this business. Uh, I guess I could gather them into here, where they'll build a city, right? <laughs> so that's not, <laughs> not awesome. Well, I mean, if you get to, uh, if you get, I mean, you're not really at the point where you could just get your tier three and eight every turn, or even tier two. But, um, like, if you're able to, so, like, reliably destroy cities, then you're not really worried about cities. Yeah. Like, other spirits definitely have to worry more about yeah, cities, I'm but lightning can destroy cities with lightning's innate, which is really nice. Yeah, and, like, a city that's in the mountain now is not as a big a deal as it is in other places, so I can just do that. I think you're looking for overgrow. If you want yeah. to proliferate, you have to choose a spirit. Oh, wait, yes, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Hey, it's 1 a.m. for me. That's fair. You're deep into the whiskey. <laughs> Do I want Not six card plays? Six card plays would be nice. I can, I can, I can't afford it right now. <laughs> Maybe I can. I have two more free cards. I can afford to play five cards, and then I can get a plus one energy actually I can play to five play six cards so yeah I can afford six card plays and that would be what I want to do so I guess we'll this is what I called on Thursday the greedy play <laughs> let's go You're, are you stopping this ravage here Seamus yes I am well, in one way or another. So I'll go this way. This gives me good visibility over here to deal with these built-up areas. Okay, that's me done for fast. All right, uh, lightning's boon to river. Woo! All right, let me take care of my stuff. This. This. Fear card. Fear card. Nice. Our first fear card. So exciting. Uh, shatter that homestead. Right, I'm all lure of the unknown. Right, so I could. I don't know what's better. Actually, you know what? Since this is so inland, I would be pushing it like sort of more inland and causing more problems. I'd rather just let them build a city here, but then they're gonna ravage there, right? So I don't know if that's. But I'm just reclaiming, so I'll blow it all up next turn anyways. Right. <laughs> so who, who cares? That really doesn't matter. So, I'll shatter this homestead. Because I think I'd rather have the city be built here in this sand as opposed to a mountain that might come up again, like, shortly, so. And then I was just going to call the bloodshed here because they're not going to build... Oh, I can't reach that spot. Well, well, I could save that. I could save that to the slow phase. Why don't you do your stuff and then we'll see where we are. Yeah, so... Massive flooding. Oh, actually, if you if you Dahan River's Bounty into seven, then I just call the bloodshed there. <laughs> Don't wash them away. Bring the Dahan into so, D7. D7? Yeah, because then I can kill them all. Six Dahan. Or, sorry, three Dahan, three damage there. They don't build. Oh, you're going to do it fast. Oh, I see. Duh. 
Okay. Oh, they no, they don't build because they don't build in either in the mountain five. Perfect. Yeah, there's only one adjacent. Look at this clean wetland. All right, so what do you want? Leave the Dahan here. Uh, Leave these Dahan. Save the Dahan army. I don't know. Not sure Either from the army or from, Dahan, probably from. Yeah, leave them on the coast because I want to use them for the sand up there. So the okay. ones from the big army, I think. Yeah, I mean, it's just it's doing nothing in an empty board or empty land. So. Yeah. And then I will call the bloodshed on that land and solve several problems at once. Actually, are they still going to build because they're building in both of these places? But you know what? At least they're not building a city. No, they're they build will. a town. Also here, have they a will still in energy. Yes. Yeah, they're going to build because they're building in the mountains over there first on the coast. Oh, yeah. It's okay, though. It's still it's fine. They're just right. not building a city. So it's it towns are easy for all of us to deal with. So we also still have a wash away in case we wanted it or need it. Yep. Here, have a bajillion energy. <laughs> I'll take it. Remove a town or explore from a land with ah. sacred site. Hmm. Well, then you could uh, take it from the jungle there and you don't have to remove your presence. Yep. Oh, uh, I guess that's your sacred site, but my board. And let's see. Third one. Oh, yeah. And then they won't build up here, right? Yeah. Yeah, we just stopped I'm not uh, one Ravage and two spot. builds. Or no, I'm not. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, no, we are stopping the build in D4 with what I did. It's only adjacent to a city. Um, it's a one damage Ravage. That. Yeah, we'll allow that Ravage. <laughs> Oh, yeah, and they still built in the sands anyway because of the uh, two mountains. Oh, well. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Because of the high immigration they built there first. And hey, explore the mountains. Well, the biggest built up place has one building in it, so. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good. Um, the jungle, maybe, right? Because they're not doing anything there. Yeah. Wetlands here. I used up all my business in the fast phase. Another fear card. All right, so wash away in D4, maybe? Or D7? Yeah, I mean, that just sort of takes care of it for the Ravage. Or you could stop a build somewhere else if you'd rather. This is also going to Ravage, not but actually... that, that doesn't matter. Yeah, I think the only land that really makes sense is this one. This is push, so yeah, I can push here. Into um, the wetlands. <laughs> into the wetlands. I mean, if you're going to use your innate again, then somewhere put them all together, right? Like, Yeah, I'm actually equipped to just do this every single round. How many card plays do I have? I only have four. I complain about that. And I can make you fast every single round. Yeah, so just <laughs> constant grouping and using my tier two innate or tier three innate to just wipe a single land. Keep using the hammer. I would like another present so I could have five card plays, so I could actually play my five cards. Well, give someone maybe a gift Green can help you out with that. But... <laughs> yeah, Green could help. So, do I want to replace Gift of Constancy with a potential Major? I can't really play the Major, though, if I'm going to do all the things. But... That is zero energy, so I probably should save it. 
By the way, we didn't actually call this out, but look at this. We can move this now. <laughs> well, I'm also gaining a power card, so I will click that. Sure. And uh, I believe I will be uh, one, two, three, four. Give me a power card if I'm giving Vivo um, a presence play. Yeah, I don't know if you have to, but. I think Lou just wanted it at some point. It doesn't need to be right now, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so... I think I'm going to continue taking miners, at least right now. Steam vents. Doesn't do anything, but it has my elements on it. And is there a town in a city where I have presence? Yes. Is there an explorer? Yes. That's fine. Steam vents it is. For the elements. I think it's encompassing water. Oh, wait. Did it have water, though? Did it have water? water? Yes, it is. It does. OK, perfect. Then definitely taking it. It's literally I'm definitely your playing card. it. C2 Ward is literally <laughs> literally Rivers yeah. card. I don't care what Steam Vents does, I just want the elements on it. <laughs> Spoiler alert, Steam Vents doesn't do anything anyway. <laughs> <laughs> if it had range one, it would be an okay it would be a much better card like a way better card if it had range one. You played all your cards. Yes, yes I did. And that's me done. Mm -hmm. You know what you're playing, Lude? I'm just thinking, I only reclaim one, right? Yeah. I could reclaim two if I played... Uh, encompassing, or yeah, Gift, gift of, of Constancy. Constancy. But I only have four card plays, and I won't get to the... Do we point. want Encompassing Ward? There's like one Ravage that's two Ravages that are doing anything, and we can easily just blow up the towns. Well, I'm just trying... I'm, I'm just thinking whatever. whether I could get away with not reclaiming next turn, but still have my Tier 3 innate if I set this up correctly, but I can't because I don't have the right elements. Unless I gain a power card next turn. Uh, you I can might. gain a power card if Seamus chooses you. <laughs> Sorry, what? Oh, yeah, Gift of Power. Yeah. Uh, I'm just thinking out loud about skipping the reclaim all next turn and doing gain power card and two presents or double presents. If you do Gift of Power on me, then there's a chance I get a water card, which is okay. basically what I need in order to do my tier three innate next turn and this turn. Yeah, I can do that. All right. So it doesn't necessarily need to be all Lightning's cards because we have Encompassing Ward now. But yeah, as you said, there's not really a place where the Ravaging in a sense, I could defend there to stop a Blight from happening, you know, because points. <laughs> Uh, I can also potentially blow up a town in one of those places if we want. They're going to do mountains next turn. We're destroying all of that. Incidentally, I would particularly not... Are we going to do it faster still? I don't know. Well, it's fine. I will... Um, you can do it fast. We'll save it this fast. turn. Oh, yeah. If you're going to boon me, then that would do it. Then So River's Bounty every you turn. You also, like... <laughs> You Luna can wash figure. away the guys from B3 into there and kill them all, too. So I need sun and water. So it's either Flash Floods or Encompassing Ward. I guess it's Flash Floods. Um, you need Constancy for your next turn setup? Uh, if I play Constancy, I won't have enough. Uh, oh, right. For the, for the Tier 3. Right. Like I could instead of dealing with like instead of dealing with this mountain this turn I could deal with the jungle because they're building there 
I could stop that build. And then next turn, as long as I'm boomed, I guess, deal with the mountain. Maybe not. Maybe I should deal with the mountain first, in which case I don't need to be boomed. They're only building a city, which with flash floods would take out that city plus the innate. So they're building a city in both lands. So I'll still boon you. So then they don't build anything. Okay. Oh yeah, because I see what you're saying. Wash away from C3 into B8 and then... Yeah. Okay. See, I, I have heard it, but I was also thinking <laughs> while I was doing it, so while you're we speaking, so I didn't really catch on to the entire plan. Steam vents. The other water card. Uh... The other card with both elements on it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so let's see. I probably want Shatter Homesteads to stop one of these. I guess Call of Bloodshed stops one and Shatter Homestead stops the other. So that seems good. Because I can have the Dahan kill the town in this one. Works for me. All right, I'll send my lightning spoon over and then go ahead, either of you. I'll send my boon to you. Yay, I'll take six energy. <laughs> I guess I'm taking a major this turn. I just think boon of vigor on lightning every single turn. Boon of vigor on lightning every single turn. River's bounty every single turn. That's just what my now game my goal, is. My new uh, goal is to play six majors every turn. <laughs> uh, is anybody taking care of the Ravage in Sans 5 or Sans 3 on my board? I was taking care of both of them, but if you want to take care of one of them, then I don't no, have to take it. It means I can just do Blight Removal instead. Yeah. Oh, points. Feel free to do Blight Removal. That's my fast phase done. <laughs> All right. So let's do uh, absolute bloodshed. Green is fine not getting any boons. <laughs> boons are for other people. Green likes to give them. <laughs> <laughs> so I still have a flash right, flood. Flash floods to stop a uh, stop a build somewhere. Where? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Hashtag England. Uh, mount a mountain up somewhere. Yeah, no, I guess not. I don't have range. Uh, destroy the town and the coast then. That's gonna build regardless. Can't reach that. B7. Destroy it. That's adjacent. Destroy oh, okay, we're gonna destroy one of those, so that would stop that. Okay. Yep. So yeah, this is gonna be shattered. And we have a fear card that's probably going to get rid of a bunch of explorers. Uh, call the bloodshed over here. It might also just give defend in every land where there's a sacred site. <laughs> I don't know. There's We already got a card that said remove one from an inland land, right? So. Oh, yeah. It's innate that does things. Oh, look. Everyone's dying. Uh, I guess I could gather away Mountain this. Mountain seven with steam vents. Oh no, sorry, it's range zero. It's range zero. That's why yeah. it sucks. Oh, I, I got it literally for the elements only. <laughs> the effect does not. <laughs> the effect literally almost never does anything. Uh, yeah, there's one land, two lands where it does something. Uh, it does stop a build here, right? So that's not nothing. I just, I cannot say enough about how this card is, needs an improvement. I mean, it does, <laughs> I mean, it has, it has four elements on it, right? That's why the effect is almost nothing. Right. Uh, the elements are why it's, it exists. So I can lure this town away. It's more the Basically, elements of why it has a cost. Yeah. I guess he is going 
just for a trip along the seaside. And will Raging Storm do anything? I guess it blocks a build here. It blocks a build not there. Yeah, it yeah, is if you fast had flash flooded, If you had flash flooded here, we could kill this city. But you did it somewhere else, so that's fine. Well, because you told me that was the plan. <laughs> but no, we I stopped. Mean, that, I told I mean, you like, to start the town was... here. <laughs> It was um, stop didn't two builds versus least. stop one build, right? So uh, Mountain 7? Jungle's not yeah, a priority. That... Jungle I can deal with. Yeah, that's where I was going to do it, Seamus. Just looking around. Da 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 Aha, defend two in all lands with presence. See, I told you. Called what it. What an amazing fear card. <laughs> I mean, I'd let them build a town there. Okay. It's not a big deal. I mean, it, it does. There, yeah, it doesn't really change visibility if we're explorers much, right? So. That was a great ravage. Yeah, because they're building nearby, anyways. Coastal lands? Coastal I lands. It. I mean, a 50 50 chance. <laughs> True. Well, no. No, uh, no one th that's one out of three. 33% chance. What? The high immigration didn't go away. What? High immigration continues. But it says right here remove the tile when a stage two card slides onto it. I'm reporting this bug. It says below, don't do that. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm just going to mock all the people who will do that because they're... Uh, we haven't gotten that people. report, actually. We get a lot of reports about green because people don't understand how the special rule works. <laughs> that it costs energy when the island's blighted and that it doesn't work for powers, only for growth. Mm. Yep. And I'm... Anytime I get a report like that, like I know that people play it wrong on the tabletop because <laughs> they're reporting that it's a bug. <laughs> yeah, I need a bounty somewhere. Uh, play the ultimate target on D4. But nothing's happening there. <laughs> the, no, but you need to play the ultimate target and then get Jim's hat. <laughs> oh, I gotcha. I mean, uh, you have coastal lands that have uh, guys in them. Now. Yeah, but I'm not worried about them. I mean, There's like the ravage in D5. Yeah, they already have Dahan, and I'm not worried about that either. I have encompassing ward. You're an encompassing ward. The problem is that you're not where the problems are. <laughs> yeah, what's happening in land B? Land B, Shaman and I are going to take care of it together. It's going to be a team effort. Can you push that town out of C7? Or, yeah, I guess either one, really. <laughs> Where'd you want to go? Anywhere else. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Uh, Lude wanted... Lude did want. Yeah, so my goal is to not have to reclaim all. There's a card with the water on it. The yeah. one. Yeah, I need to have... Yeah, I... I'm going to reclaim a card that has a sun and water on it. And if I take this card, that's the only water card, so it's probably just going to be that card. Um, and it also gives me defend five for, you know, D2. So yeah, I just need one more water card next turn. I'll take energy off of this and do that. We'll have enough energy. I'll have... Yeah, then if you put a presence in... I'll have five. D7, you can kill that town too.
with yeah. encompassing word. Yeah, so they got D7 covered. Or B7. The Dahan arrive. Lou just like, bring them back. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. So if I do my innate with flash floods in D2, that wipes this out, which would stop. I guess no, because there's still going to be these two lands, so this build's still going to happen, but... I defend two would take care of both of these. And I have a defend six... Defend five, I guess. To help with the uh, nine damage happening in B. Whatever. It's not super great, but... Do I have range for that? No, I don't. It's range zero. Okay, what well, never mind. Yeah. Green is there. There's no Ravage there. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, if Green doesn't just want to keep losing uh, presents and have seven destroyed presences, but... Green can just play them. Yeah, he can get them back. There's a reason why I've been actually uh, trying to keep the uh, <laughs> island healthy. It's so I don't have to pay energy to keep to keep playing them. Yeah. Yes, indeed. <laughs> I would put them along the coast there where you like that... Uh, right? D3 or something? Yeah, because I'm not necessarily dealing with these at all, really. Because I'm not going to necessarily wash away. I can't wash away. I'm flesh flooding. Hmm. Yeah, but if I have to defend two, then I don't care about that. So yeah, we'll just throw Dahan there. Make more Dahan. More points. Except it's less points because more invader cards come out of the deck. Right, so I'm going to do my it. thing first. Power Storm, the River's Bounty. <laughs> oh, the deck's empty. <laughs> You're going to reshuffle. So I'll what are the chances well. of me not getting a water major power? power. Uh, I will be gaining a power as well. All right, so I absolutely don't want a major because it could be an expensive major, maybe. Or maybe not. I mean... You're only spending one other energy necessarily right like if i if i don't take wash away and i take river's bounty oh no i have to take oh no i'm doing flash floods. right never mind it could I'm be flash floods, floods or lunar bigger right yeah it could be that and then i could take a four energy card uh but i have to, i would have to forget one of these cards yes so maybe you don't want that yeah, I'll just go minor for safety. I need a water. None of these are water. <laughs> uh, all right, all right I'll you, hit undo. While you, think oh, about that, while you think about that, I will also reclaim and gain a power card. And this time, our first major of the evening. Oh, look, hey, there's look, a water. It's, look, it's the one for lightning. Uh, and you are also reclaiming. Yes. I chose poorly. And choose your deck. Minor. Might have to move that out of the way. <laughs> There's a water. There's two waters. What are you talking about, Lou? There's waters. Damn it! Oh god, they're hideous. Can I redraw? Reaching grasp so isn't happy with too reaching bad. grasp too. Yeah. Yeah, they're not good for green. That's for sure. Is literally any element of yours on there? Water. Water. There's, water. there's two water. <laughs> and there's one moon card. Yeah. There's what? What? I would love this draw. <laughs> yeah I shouldn't have gone first <laughs> oh well I would have also yeah, liked right. accelerated that it would have been fun I don't necessarily automatically take 
talons of lightning but it's pretty awesome because there's lots of bad stuff in wetlands and mountains and it's really awesome vigor is <laughs> so, pretty yeah. good vigor is pretty good too, yeah though but... and the chance of you not being able to get the uh the threshold i, I will get the threshold I, it does cost six, but I have nine energy. Yeah. So I won't be able to get to my top innate if I play it because I won't have enough water this turn. But guess which card I haven't played at all? Bye. <laughs> 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 all right, you can go ahead, loot, and pick from your meager choices. Yeah. Living Energy has a sunbeam on it. <laughs> and Dark and Tangled Boots has Earth. Yeah, I don't really care about those. <laughs> All right. The so one I'm damage not... to one damage to each is actually not bad for you with combined with your true. And it is range but zero, it is sacred range zero. site. Yeah, but tough, tough to I play. Mean, if it's a wetland, we have like, if, I put, now, right? if I put a wetland, if I put a presence in B one, I could. But wait, Use we have really reaching grasp now, don't we? Is that what you picked, yeah. Seamus? I did so. Yeah, yeah, so reaching grasp lets you use your power like everywhere, and it's really and that right. power everywhere. True. Yeah, so I have to so the forego the just, whole. Like, kill. Get, I mean, I can't really yeah. take the. I don't have a water anyway, so I guess it is going to be quick. I mean, yeah, you don't actually get the, you don't actually get to do both because it doesn't have the right elements, but it's a nice thought. I'm gonna plant myself here. Yeah, so I can't get to the tier three innate. I still want a water. No. Thankfully, every single one of these is water, but. Should I keep with the river's bounty every turn game or should I go give John energy game? Uh, keep John I'm and spending keep... all my energy every turn, so yeah, I think <laughs> and I have, I have nine, and I'm still spending it all every turn. <laughs> Loga River having only fast cards. <laughs> oh wow! So I guess uh, I don't have to play Lightning's Boon actually, unless I want it for the elements. So if you want to avoid reclaiming for whatever reason, save it for next turn because I would like to be right. able to clear out the jungle fast. Yeah, because they're, they're going to build there this turn, Ravage next, yeah. And they're going to escalate into there, so. So I'm going to blow up one of those wetland or uh, mountain Seamus. So whichever one you don't want to blow up, I'll blow up. <laughs> okay. Um... Lude wanted reaching grasp, yes? Oh, you know what? You know what? I placed my presence in that wetland, but I needed to be in B7. Didn't I? I guess it doesn't matter. I have steps. No, that's... Oh, wait, no, but I'm going to have reaching no, grasp. No, I can fix that. Yeah, reaching okay, grasp. Let you... Okay, if I have reaching grasp, I don't care then. Unless you don't want to play Reaching Grasp, but then you could put your presence there instead. Is the thing. Yeah, if you don't want to play Reaching Grasp, I can put my presence in uh, B7. I forgot I needed to do that. I mean, or, I mean, Seamus can just proliferate you there. So, there you go. <laughs> Fair enough. That's just as good. Yep, that's me done. Even, even better. All right, we're finished playing cards. All right, I'm going to play my six <laughs> energy card. And then probably all my zero energy cards. And three still more, three more cards. So it's all the ones with one energy. Unless that's not super necessary because I'm not going to get all the waters. Well, remember that you're going to be Boon of Vigor, so one energy cards are really zero energy cards. Oh, that's true. So I may as well... I'm not... Well, so it's either Bloodshed or 
lightning spoon. They both give me fire. Oh, it's both. Or, or I could play Shatter Homesteads, I guess. That's the thing. Would you want a lightning spoon, Seamus? Does it matter? Um, I guess, or for River, you do have a slow power. Your innate power. I don't think it will matter for the Ravage here. Uh, it doesn't make a difference if my stuff goes fast or slow. Okay. Well, I want to play Call the Bloodshed anyways, because that is good for these spots. And, right. As you said, since you're giving me Buna Vigor, I may as well play it. And I will give Lightning's Boon to Lude, as always, then. <laughs> and I'll give the Boon to Seamus this time. <laughs> no. And I will give Gifts of Proliferation to Lude. Aww. So many presents. Alright, so I put the presents here, and then I Encompassing Ward myself, and I don't care about all of these defends, or all these ravages in the... The, the, the only yeah. danger one is B2, but are you uh, overgrowing into that? No, I, I can also just... Board. I can just kill everything there. Yeah, oh, kill okay. everything in the mountain. Well, okay, here. I can, Oh, I can't reach... I can't... Oh, right, because I'm not... You didn't... Right, you're not... You want me, I will do it. Hang on. Uh, Talons of Lightning. Uh, five damage. Destroy one town in each adjacent land and then i also have my innate power that i can not see with that but let's just see what we can get done do you want me to kill the explorers um massive flooding does okay right. uh, oh yeah actually, massive flooding. Sorry. yeah um, I have stemmed the flow of fresh water. So if right, you but do loot, damage... loot has massive flooding. Loot has massive flooding fast now, too, so I think that also does it, right? He can uh, do two damage and push away. Okay. Um... So I think that... Yeah, I, yeah, I could I could Lightning Spoon you, but I think that also... No, no. Oh, yeah, so you're just trying to do stuff in the fast phase. Uh... Yeah. So actually, stem the flow is better, right? Because it's one damage to each. Terrible city. I don't know if it's better. I think there's still two explorers left in that case, though. Ah, oh, wait. So... Sorry. No. Um, just give it to me, and then I can use Creeper's Tear into Mortar and do three damage in there as well to towns and cities. Okay. I support this. We need to go back. We need to go and back, Lightning. Kate. We need to go back. Lightning Spoon. Here. All right. We need the other boons to happen now. <laughs> Stop it. I guess that doesn't need to happen just now. Or that was gift of power. Oh, so, okay. Uh oh. Be the wrong we cut. can't undo. Oh, we can't undo new information. Okay. Yeah, that does. Okay, we can't undo now, which means back. that we lose all of these things. Rip. I might have screwed up because I was also moving the mouse too because I was going to Boon of Vigor, John, and I think that confused things. So sorry. That was my bad. Um, no, no, no. Gain of power. There's no water cards again. <laughs> we, we used them all up. Um, I think I'm just going to take Call to Migrate. I don't really expect to use it, but at least it gives us better Dahan movements. Right, so, sorry. So, gift of proliferation are lewd. Yeah. I'm just thinking if, since you're not going to be able to do the stem of flow and creepers now. It's okay. Well, I still have. Oh, I won't have the sacred site for that. You still have things? Okay. And I'll just do the defend thing I was going to do. And then Boon here. Someone has a gift of constancy. I have a defend that's not going to make a difference. Oh, right. This would have worked fine in that land if we needed that instead. 
Okay, the wrong card. I have one damage to each that also doesn't really matter, but I'll do it here. And then I don't know what to do with these, so I'll get I'll hand it off. Alright, so you are going to do I think how many levels of creeper do you have? I have three levels of creeper. Yeah, so cre three levels of creeper will let me do I can do five damage, right? So that's I think necessary in that. That would mountain. that would take care of the mountain by itself if you yeah. did that to take out a city. Yeah. So just kill one city. Just kill one city and then I can leave it with one explorer left. Okay, so I will Talons of Lightning. There's no other town. I guess there was a town I could like lure in. No, I can't lure because there has to be no invaders, so that wouldn't work. Also kills towns in neighboring areas. So, is there anywhere I can reach with the Defend 4 that's useful? Oh, I guess we could have used it there, but it's all taken care of everywhere, so. <laughs> so I'll stick that in there to be on the safe side. Another few cards! Woo! Alright, so I have my innate that can also destroy two buildings somewhere, which is going to be up here. You can say, oh yeah, there's these guys that are basically making it so they're building. This guy's ravaging and dying before. Oh, I and steam the sand is, good. The sand is going to build a town and a city. Yeah. Sorry, sands. Yes. And it's because of these two towns. Well, actually, no. They're not. They are not building there at all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You can steam vents them now. Yeah, and I, I can steam vents. For, <laughs> oh, for look, I use for steam vents. There might be another place, but there really isn't, so anywhere doesn't matter. But yeah, because I got rid of that town, they won't build here at all. Or in the mountain now. So they will build in C1, but that's okay. All right, so John's basically uh, going to reclaim all, right? Yep, every Next turn, time. every all day. So a gift every to constancy day. would only make sense on green. Unless you want to give me two more energy, but I'm okay. <laughs> um, I'm going to use that to grab a um, major power. And I have a defend five, but everything's defended, so none of this matters. The ravages in the mountains. Mountains are empty. Here, we'll defend. Do it. There. A fear card. Defend six in coastal lands. <laughs> nice. Uh, two oh, hey, yeah, remove the top owl on my board. I'm a player. I choose here. Boop. No build. Uh, the sun's on B. That stops a build. That stops two builds. And I nominate C5 Wetland unless there's a better place because that is a source of invaders for a lot of areas right now. Yeah. That also, that also stops the escalation. Yeah. Because there won't be any yeah. towns on your board. These are going to build regardless of what we do. So, yeah. 
Oh, second fear card, by the way. We've had one yep. fear card, yes, but what about second fear card? <laughs> Extra <Yay>, more defense. <laughs> Great. We're we're ready for that. Only two high immigration builds. Well, my board's fine. What are you guys doing? <laughs> I mean, you can allow that build if you want, because I'm going to blow all that up on my turn. But it's up to you, I guess. He has a triple sacred site, so he doesn't really care. <laughs> I'd push him the thing just to stop it, so... Sure. Wetlands. They don't explore in many, very many wetlands. Do you want to also stop the, the uh, escalation build? <laughs> Mm, no. Which we'll have out. They don't explore in the top wetlands at all. That's nice. Right, I have a massive flooding that deals two damage and pushes three. And can... I can do one damage to Eternal City. So the. These cities are partially damaged. I could do massive flooding on that just to take out a city. But I mean, like, also well, stopping a ravage in my coastal lands would be fine. Yeah, I mean, that's the only place that it makes sense to do anything anyways, so. In case that changes your mind. Like, I have to do my innate on this jungle because it has five now, and that's the yeah, go for it. Yeah, So I what am I going to do? I'll be right back. If I reclaim all and I have my defend two, right? So it's not going to be enough, but I would probably be able to deal with one of the explorers in one of the places and push the other in the other. Yeah, so I think if I just take a city out, oh, I guess there's still a, oh, but I can push the town. This will also be defended, too, if I did Encompassing Ward. Push the town into Mountain 2. And then, let's see. They're not doing anything in the jungle, so that's probably the best place for them. Or Sands. I mean, these are just Explorers, so no one cares about those. Except for Shadows Flicker Like Flame. Okay, and I'm gonna reclaim all anyway, so this choice doesn't matter. All right, reclaim all. Six energy. I think I'm going for major, because I have lots of things I could just forget. Ooh, tsunami, hello. Uh, cleansing flood. I think flood's also really good too. Yeah, because the like everyone loves tsunami except I don't like Dahan destruction. <laughs> I mean, I guess like okay, so that. So if I did tsunami fast, I have eight damage, and four damage on the other coastal lands, right? So three, six, eight. But like we're doing my innate here, so that doesn't really matter, right? But destroying the town there, destroying the town there. I guess it's basically doing the same. thing. But I'm defending too, right? So actually, it wouldn't do the same thing. Well, you could wipe out everything in Wetlands 1. However, you'd be doing 14 damage if you took the other one, and that's 6. So, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You'd actually entirely wipe out uh, Jungle 2 with Cleansing Floods. I also remove a Blight with that, right? So that would be pretty good for points. Yeah. 3, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14. Yeah, I would wipe that out entirely. And would you like to do it in the fast phase? Okay. Probably. <laughs> so I guess it's cleansing floods. And Jungle Hunger is pretty good too, but yeah, cleansing floods is pretty wild for river. Oh, 
do it this way Ooh. so I can actually view this better. Do we need to defend 10 or 1 damage to each? I mean, like, I guess that combos with my innate, so... Yeah, I think the other one, unless you want the water on it, is... The 1 damage to each is good with your innate, because it wipes out everything. Right. Probably wash away at this point. Do I need it? Like, I have five card plays, so as long as I play four water cards plus, like, Gift of Constancy or Quicken the Earth Struggles, I'll be fine. Well, let's just double check if I can even do this. I have one energy well, have right one now. One more energy. <laughs> oh, yeah, if you need that water from Sap to Strength, then. Yeah, you need you don't get your innate, but oh yeah, you do if you play. I have my innate. One more energy. But cleansing floods fast takes out D two. Right, and I have this threshold. Yeah, I have that threshold. Of course I do. Randomly have a defend five for one of the lands. Energy to lightning, rivers bounty because awesome. Defend two in each of the lands. So I'd still have to figure out D three, I guess. Defend five. Probably also D one. You have defend five for D three. Oh, yeah, but and that's enough to Han that you figure it out. Oh, but if I'm if I'm, oh, I guess like we also have massive flooding. But I guess like, hmm. I don't know. You guys do things. I think I've decided what I'm doing. Don't worry. There are other spirits also blowing up buildings. <laughs> <right>. <laughs> uh, let me just check my board. I'm pretty sure. Yes. Trees and stones? I don't know, Pillar of Living Flame really speaks to how green works. Yes, it does. <laughs> we've got all this great tingle that we've, we've been destroying. <laughs> Have it! <laughs> Burn the forest. And through it we knew. Um, Trees and Stones Speaks for War, I think, is the only one I'm going to get thresholds on. And I'm going to forget Gift. Yeah, Overgrow is just a fear card now. Um, do I need? I suppose yes. I might need to find something there. Oh wait, it's only junk. Um. I need an earth. And then uh... I wouldn't mind uh proliferate to make a sacred site in the jungle there. This is perfectly acceptable. Excellent. All right. According to Lewd, I should have 12 cards because I can play six cards. <laughs> That's the strategy I, I recall. Uh, I don't have 12 cards yet, but let's work on that. Yeah. What John's referring to is 
what I said on Thursday, which was however many cards you can play, if you can have a hand that's twice that size, you can go around without reclaiming and still play like your max card plays. Unless you have, you know, reclaim one like like River does. Like I, I could very I well need. not reclaim all next turn and reclaim one and still play five cards, but that was my general goal with Lightning on Thursday stream, and I was able to get a lot of growth on Lightning without having to be proliferated. I guess this wipes out that B2. Um, I could also just use my innate for it. Treason Stones is going to be doing a lot of damage there. There's no Dahan there. You bringing Dahan in? Yes. I'm going to beat up uh, B1 and move them in. For... Oh, wait. Are you moving to Han? <laughs> no, actually, whatever you can do there. Yes, I will be moving to Han in there after they beat up uh, B1, but. Uh, yeah, so I can just kill everything there in, B in B2. Yeah. Can we just take out all the towns and cities and win the game? <laughs> uh, You're not but... that far from it. Yeah, we're not. Yeah, exactly. Uh, do you need a hand down here? To destroy a town, I can do that. And let's play lots of zero cost things. Does someone want a boon? I believe so. I needed it. He needs it, he says. I need it. <laughs> He needs it. The precious. Unless, unless you really want that jungle <laughs> to cascade, you know. All right, I'll exchange it for... You've got a, th uh, a threshold on your elemental mastery. Nice. Yep, 48. If I boon 64. you, I will ex exchange for six energy. I accept. <laughs> All right, so boon on me. <laughs> All right, so then... Cleanse the so floods that, here. That just kills everything there. That's awesome. And removes the blight. blight. What? Okay, so I will gift of proliferation, John. I accept. I will make a sacred site right here. Uh, I can move some Dahan for you before Trees of Stones if you want, or were you just going to do it in B1? Uh, I was going to have them kill that city and then bring the Defend over to Mountain 2. Okay, well, I'm going to kill Mountain 2, so... So go um... ahead and kill Mountain 2, and I'll see if I can find a better place to move the Defend to. Okay. Which there is. There might be... I'm wondering if I can get another town... There's no more towns. There's not enough towns around. What if you targeted... So Talons of Lightning can target B1, right? Yeah. And that would destroy a town in B2, B5, and B6. Do you have the threshold on that? Yeah, but there's still too much stuff there. I guess I could... Oh, I, could, I, I have I mean, a defend to go in. We have massive flooding for B2 if needed. I want to blow them up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blowing them up. All right, trees and stones, feel free. Or you could just you could just literally just defend there, and then <laughs> they would die to the Dahan as well. I think it's safe to say at this point we're just dicking around with England. Yeah. <laughs> like, there's no uh, defeat at this point unless we're dumb. I think there aren't even cities anymore. Yeah, we just haven't gotten to the... Yeah, there's no cities left on the board. Anywhere to fend for is useful that I can reach. I don't think so. Do 
Okay, okay. that's me then. Yeah, so I, I have a flooding for one of the wetlands and a defend oh, for the other just, one. Make your decision for you. Okay. Well, actually, if I do the defend there, the Dahan take care of that. Yep, and Ward takes care of the other spot, and I can push Dahan into there too. If you get rid of if you get rid of or move one of the towns near the mountain number seven, they won't build there. Or I can get rid of one of the towns as well. <laughs> Do you wanna oh, that's how I, add a that's blight? how I could have pushed a town. That's how I could have pushed a town. Yeah. I could have blew up a Oh, I'm not gonna like go back. I think we can win. I'm sure we can win. I mean, we can win. Whether we win right now or next turn or whatever. Yeah, but two points, John. Two points. <laughs> I don't care about the points. Yeah. Also, we have two fear cards. So. Yeah. Are you gonna blow up all this, or with your power? I can yeah. put it put Okay. I can collect these all for you. No, come in in here. And you come in here. Sorry. And there's a town. The only last town is here, right? Unless they build on the mountain, which they shouldn't. There's no explorers. Hey, everybody. Oh, yeah, I have even more stuff. <laughs> <laughs> here, come over here. It's nice. Defend six and close to left. <laughs> Perfect turn for that. Fourteen defense in that land. With one explorer. Oh, good. Okay. Doesn't actually destroy towns. I'm gonna kill an explorer somewhere, basically. The jungle. May as well. I choose this jungle. Why are you asking me? Weird. Do you want to take out Jed or Ned? Hmm? That's that guy's dying anyways, so but sure. It doesn't really matter. Is there any other land that matters? Has anything? No, like the board's Your like land is empty. Clear, and or your board's empty. They're My dying board to, they're all dying to the ravage. Everyone except for ravage. that one explorer in the jungle is dying to the ravage. <laughs> yeah, and they're not building in any of the mountains. The so. board is almost entirely empty. Yeah, once this ravage goes off, we win, so it doesn't matter. I can't select this land. Yeah, so just click let's, anywhere. Let's gather more Dahan here. <laughs> gather a Dahan army. Sorry, they don't build in the mountains. England is gone. There are no buildings on the island! There's Woo! one explorer! Nope, two. Oh, two okay. explorers. Well, he would have died too, it just did it in The game order. didn't do it, yeah. You get to survive this time, David. Alright, we got 61 mm. points out of that. Seven so, because of 22 of living down. Did we get more minus points because of the blight I added? No. Nope. No, you have nine presents on the board. Yeah, that was a uh, that's four extra Dahan. We did lose. We lost a Dahan 
once or twice as well. Yeah. But you but made hey, lots of Dahan babies. I'm, I give us like an extra turn. point because of my constant river's bounty. So it's nice. Nicely done. That was pleasant. Yeah. It was a pretty straightforward England game instead of like uh, Nightmareville that we've had in the recent streams. Yeah, but, we really never let them get to the middle of the island, which makes a huge difference. Yeah. Keeping everything coastal yeah. prevents their view of the land, which means they don't explore as much and their escalation, or not escalation, but the uh, the indentured servants doesn't trigger as often. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah also well, the yeah, integration didn't work so either. So much destruction of towns and cities makes a big difference. One thing that we didn't see in this game was a build straight into a ravage which we had on uh, Thursday's stream because we had two consecutive wetland tiles or something. Yeah, that can be rough. Um, also, both River and Green massively supporting Lightning to go have <laughs> Just to That's help true. a little bit. It was yes. like easy mode. I could just reclaim and play six cards every turn pretty quickly, so. Yeah. And when, by the time that's, if that's happening for lightning, it's just like GG invaders. Like you can't, they cannot keep up with lightning blowing up three buildings in a land every turn and all the other things that it's happening, so. All right, so now on our second game, we're gonna play England 5, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Speed run. No talking, only doing as fast as you can. It Maybe is relatively time. early for, uh, for a Spirit Island Saturdays. <laughs> We've had like three hour, three four hour streams lately so like <laughs> if people want to do a speed run you know we could certainly yeah. do something how like, are you doing there seamus <laughs> i'm okay only quarter past two we could do a, if you want to do we, a base we could do blitz a blitz game. no talking only doing <laughs> yeah oh oh do i have my boy let me get let me get out my uh jagged earth thing real quick I'm getting another drink then while you're doing whatever you're doing. Okay. Problem is, I don't know where it is. Okay. Here is a scenario that we can play. It's called Blitz. Scenario, a diversity of spirits. Why should a spirit of the open air speak the same language as a spirit of flame and renewal or understand the deep voice of a mountain? The spirits defending the island are strong in their own nature and have difficulty communicating nuanced information to each other as a result. This scenario is less about mechanical changes and more about altering the experience of the game. Some players love it, but it's not for everyone. This scenario is notably easier for groups where the players are highly familiar with each other's playstyles and or highly familiar with all spirits being played. This spirit is notably harder when playing a spirit new to you or a spirit you don't recall well or for spirits with restrict restrictive presence placement. The rules changes. For planning and discussing strategy, spirits may not use any language shared in common at game start and may not look at each other's power cards in the spirit phase. Once the fast phase starts, you can look at each other's play cards. Obviously, we can't do that as well, but... Language can be used normally to execute game mechanics, to fear please, describing what you're doing, I destroy this town, rules questions, out of game chit chat, could you grab me a drink, and keeping the game flowing. The structure applies only to coordination and planning. When performing game effects not associated with the particular spirit, player, or board take turns making a, the, the decision. Role playing is not required but can add to the atmosphere if your group enjoys such things. In other words, we cannot discuss exactly what we're doing, but we can sort of gesture at what we're doing. Arms. Fun fact, this was part of the original design of Spirit Island, was that you weren't allowed to talk and only like grunt at each other. But Eric realized <laughs> that was really annoying. And so it didn't so that's funny that that became 
a scenario in Jagged Earth. That looks good. That's a weird ocean. Looks perfect. <laughs> So, like weird ocean. Blitz game Ooh. with limited communication. Let's go. Yeah, no adversary thing. Definitely zero. And just like, we should take a player order. So, maybe Seamus first, Lude second, me third. That's sort of how we've been doing it. So, and we're all in different spots on the screen. <laughs> yes, we're doing diversity of spirits. Of course, we yeah, can't really have closed uh, hands, but there's some designer diaries you can find on Board Game Geek that uh, go into some of that. This is my board. Oh, why are they the worst? Nom noms. <laughs> that is all Seamus will say. <laughs> <laughs> Nom noms. Lude, fetch me a drink. <laughs> Twitch Lude, chat wants fetch a drink. Twitch chat a drink. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to figure out how I can voice shadows flickering. Yeah. Like Christmas fireplace. <laughs> That's true. Hanabi has no talking. It's a really good game. Okay, I can't uh, there's a, a, <laughs> I can't look there's at an what... <laughs> He's playing because I can't see his head. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> when we get to actual multiplayer with that scenario, that's fun because then we can actually make it like you can't see what the other players are doing. All right, looks like uh, Lude, go ahead. It's my turn now? All right. Yeah. Whoosh, whoosh, uh, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. There's an amazing uh, thread on Board Game Geek where. Uh, Someone posted a rules question about Hanabi, but it was clear that they thought Hanabi was a competitive game. And it just what? sort of, yeah. So these these people were playing Hanabi as a competitive game somehow. And like they were responding to stuff. And so people like figured out what they were doing. And it was like amazing that like that but, happened. Uh, <laughs> how? <laughs> yeah, look up the thread. Uh, it's pretty. Pretty hilarious. Not too much thinking there, Lude. I can't voice my thoughts as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing a thing in order to deal with things that are thinking right now. Yeah. We all we all think think about it. Ooh, have you ever played Werewolves of Miller's Hollow? <laughs> Lude, invent a new language just for this game. Uh, All right. I know. Uh, bois. Sweet. Bois. Just as ooh. Bang. Ooh. Porque. Okay, no, that's Spanish. Damn it. <laughs> Trying to invent a language is hard. Trying to say things without actually saying a thing. <laughs> I'm not looking. <laughs> it's easy for me because I have the game entirely to one side, so I just like stare at chat and have like a hand over here so I don't view the board. <laughs> so like, the communication that we are allowed
um, I think comes down to we're not allowed to plan strategy. Can be used normally to execute game mechanics. Right, so when it says to fear, please, that's like saying add to fear to the... Like, in the physical game, you actually have to move the fear normally. That's what it is. Yeah. And describing what you're doing, which I, I think also is basically a... Uh, like, I'm going to just move this town off the board because I'm destroying it versus I plan on destroying this town, which is different, I think. What's fine? Gestures, evocative noises, and body language. Things like nodding, shrugging, or thumbs up to show effect or emotion. Pointing at lands, players, or the choice one favors on a choice event. What makes commu communication too easy? Planning by pointing at text. Indicating precise numbers, indicating precise effects using pieces. Lude, I'm going first because I'm doing a thing oh. on you. And there is also a slight rule change that we're just not going to be able to do. After growth, if he added one or more presence to lands with other spirits, spirits presence, gain one energy or reclaim one non-major power card. <laughs> well, we can't do that, so we can at least do the limited communication here. So what was it you did? I did a thing on you. A thing. Okay. I like things. Hey, look, there's invaders in my land. Oh, ho! Ha ha ha! Ho ho! Yeah! My arms. I made that better. Fusro da. <laughs> I'm cheating. That's actually like the uh, Skyrim like thing with Bobber oh, yeah. Jackie. <laughs> Boost rock, ah! And there are a bunch of like YouTube meme videos about like That's the uh, push one, right? Yeah, like different one video footage where it's uh, yeah. My favorite was like there was like a person who opened the door, and on the other side of the door there was like a big like potato cannon or something that just like pu pushed a thing onto the guy that forced them backwards it was like i mean not a gun gun but just a pushback effect it was like boost <laughs> rope okay sorry i can't use language k o <laughs> <laughs> There is no slow phase. I guess there is, because I think even in Blitz, you can use the ability that, like, makes fast powers slow that isn't Bridge and Claw. You were asking about that loot. I'm not sure if you saw my comment, but there is a power that lets you do that. Right. Francie doesn't think it thinks it works in Blitz. No, I feel like it would. So but what do the know. Blitz rules say? I'm going to pull this physical card out just because I can. Well, I'll keep my growth while you're doing that then. No, no. All powers are fast. <laughs> Oh, I Spit see. Spit powers, which are already turn. fast or made fast, cost one less energy. 
It doesn't necessarily say there's no slow phase. It just says all powers are fast. Yeah, that's why I think you can still make a fast power slow if an effect lets you do that, even in Blitz. No, no. That's how I would figure it. But, but what if All you right. play the card that says this power is now slow, and then the rules say, um, well, now it's fast again. Ha ha, too bad. Right, I'll be right back in a second. To you, too. Uh, I don't, uh, yeah, I guess you stand corrected. Uh, I don't know for sure. I suppose I can defend. Lead returns. The legend returns. Are you still doing your uh, play? Yeah. All right. I'm slow. No, everything's fast. Come on, John. <laughs> what even is no, the I don't difficulty have an in my area? Does it say? I mean, if it's just a, uh, obviously this is not a scenario you can do single player. <laughs> I guess you can, just doesn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Diversity spirits. Base difficulty. Pick the less thinky spirit. Turn your hand face down. Play random face down cards. <laughs> if you don't have enough energy to play the card and you find out during the fast power phase, well, you lose the game. <laughs> it's kind of fun not knowing hey, what yo. John or Seamus are doing. I'm just like, I have one eye closed staring at chat. All choices are made at random. Your power selections are only your elements so that random card plays don't screw you. I'm done. All right. My All turn. choices are made at random. That's a good, yeah. Good game. <laughs> I think a good variant would be when you gain a power card, someone else picks the best power card and you get don't get to pick that one. <laughs> and so you have to pick something else. You can only ever take the second you can't, best card. You can't pick your choice that you want. Uh, no, one thing we've been considering doing because it's so rare that you get the major power cards that you want is start the game, you pick four power, four major powers, and those are the only four major powers you're going to get, but you're going to get the ones you want. Oh, so a little progression deck, kind of. Yeah, but just for major powers. We're just trying to think of something to offset it. Right. Because, you know, it, it's fun for Ocean when you can guarantee you're going to get Tsunami. Yeah, well, it's, especially as the decks get bigger, too, like, it's very likely, it's more likely you, you get a draw of, like, a bunch of defend, and it's like, well, that's not what I wanted, or no defend. 
I mean, whatever, depending on what you're looking for. Last Thursday was the first time we'd ever actually had to shuffle the uh, Major Powers deck. <laughs> Do you have like Bringer and Ocean and? <laughs> um. Done. Right. Someone go. <laughs> Action forward. Uh, ocean. <laughs> ocean just clicks <laughs> <finishing your powers. laughs> Goodbye. I mean, if you need to, if you weren't actually done using playing powers, you could also, you could certainly rewind. I did not look at what any of you guys did, or even what your cards are in hand. That's I'm mainly just it. focusing on my land. Yeah. I shouldn't say that. That's strategy, but that's all. I mean. With the board layout as it is, there's no way I'm getting over to you, like, in the game. <laughs> <laughs> so, I do have a long-range presence, but... Oh, I'm doing a thing. No, sorry. No, sorry. Oh, no, I'm not doing a thing. No thing is done. Now you're doing a thing. I think he wants to om-nom-nom. Waka waka waka! <laughs> Fuso! Fusoni! <laughs> Competitive Spirit Island. I mean, there there are Spirit Island tournaments that are based on like getting the best points. Or Here's the thing, and I'm kind of... Okay, this is probably too much communication. I also had a plan for this. <laughs> nom nom! Um, nom 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 Okay, okay. Mm. Nom nom! This does teleport to Han if you want them to go anywhere else. Oh, right, yeah, it's not actually done yet. Oh, it doesn't because Ocean's not I there. thought... Oh. What? I thought Ocean... Wait, Tidal Boon says... It's not Ocean's oh, Ocean. It has to be your Ocean. Right. So it doesn't work if Ocean's not actually there. That communication is allowed because that's rules discussion. <laughs> yeah. Wow. All right, you may as well finish up Seamus with your gift of power. Not Steam Vents, <laughs> the best card. <laughs> nom nom. All right, Lou, do you have ideas? Are you allowed to even verbalize that? <laughs> um, right. nom, 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 nom. So if that scenario is active, we have to have like a Trojan horse in the game that like disables your microphone so you can't like talk to anyone. Shadows. <laughs> oh, I'm doing a thing. Mantle of Dread can push and explore in a town. Okay. Wait, I guess there's a fear card that we know. I forgot about that. We know. Fear card says things. One explorer from a land with Dahan. Are you doing a thing or are you waiting for me? Oh, are you still growing? I'm sorry. Or no, it's my turn. It's my turn. You're Yeah. It's all me. Okay. I'm thinking. I'm thinking in no words. No words at all. Kuno, Kuno me. Hmm. All right, while you're thinking too long, I can go. Are you ready? Okay. Mm. 
<laughs> oh. Nom, nom. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Just make make a play. Powers awakened. Can't do that there. Oh well. This guy's dead already, right? <laughs> Two fear cards. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, we can't gesture at anything. <laughs> oh, Seamus, click your land. And then, Lude, click your land. And then I'll click my land. That's my land. <laughs> no. it's, it's not board based, this one. <sighs> That wasn't my land. He was dead. <laughs> he was already dead. Yeah, so was the guy that Seamus touched. <laughs> no, he wasn't. He was going to build there. Oh, he was? Oh. Okay. This guy wasn't going to build, and then he was going to ravage next turn and be dead. Right, Matt. Right. Oh. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I don't really think there's good options. Also remove Explorer from an inland land. I click that too. <laughs> but whose decision oh. was that? Was that Seamus' decision or my decision that you usurped? That no, was that, mine that... and Seamus clicked it as well. So now it's you. Okay. <laughs> We're kind of bad at this. <laughs> Choose for me. <laughs> it's a speed run. It's going to be bad. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Seamus, you're bored. Hey, it didn't happen on mine. Or it just did automatically because there was only one. I guess. Probably yeah, just because there was one. Oh, yeah, because they skipped the explore because of my thing that I chose. Yay, I did a thing. So it turns out I also stopped that build then. <laughs> I guess they were dying anyway. Never mind. I didn't do it. Never mind. They weren't going to build. I know. They weren't going to build. I realized that two seconds effect. after I said it. Hey, Lou, they were. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just having callbacks to my first game. 
when like there were three or four different like times that game? I forgot my very very oh, first yeah, game right. where I kept forgetting this explorer was dead by Dahan. Yeah, leave that guy there. No, leave that guy there. Remember, leave that guy there. <laughs> <laughs> but I gotta stop the build. Well, they're gonna ravage and die anyway. Nom nom. <laughs> you go in loot or is it me? Uh, it is John next, I think. All right. <clears throat> nom nom. <laughs> hey, who's taking the mouse? Some lump. Right. Is it my turn? Or is it it's shadows, okay. Or not shadows. I am shadows. You are bringers. I'm <laughs> um, nom's Wait, no. Yeah, um, Om Nom's Hungry Crasp. Or whatever. Ocean's... Not Mighty Crasp. That's OMG. We are talking about how it's OHG and not OMG. O-H-G-O-M-G? Yeah. OMG? WTF, LMAO? Nom noms. Hey, that's my major. Um. <laughs> And oceans major. <laughs> num num. Think too much for a speed run, dude. <laughs> well, I mean, your 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 decisions have been longer than mine, so. True. That's it. That's okay. You can still yell at me same way. gonna reveal a fear card do you want me to do that first before yeah no, no. Uh, doop, 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 
Nom nom. Ah. Oh. No noms. <laughs> Less noms. Oh. You can click on the one you want. <laughs> I have to go to the bathroom real quick, so I'll be right back. All right, have fun. No moms. I love that means that he's gonna indomitable claim like here. <laughs> nom nom. <laughs> All right. Nom nom. Nom nom. Has to be that. Doesn't work. Sacred site. I hate it. No one has destroyed presence. Later turns. No 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 no. no, no. Do you think I should pick this? Nom nom. <laughs> That's gesturing. <laughs> That's gesturing. <laughs> Illegal. Foul. Red flag. I have to pick this one. Nom nom. Damage. Should have put presence more inland. Oh, you can still reach there? I didn't think you could reach there. Oh, you can, because you're. Cause you're <laughs> you. Well, that's just as good. No, Siri, I'm not talking to you. I don't know why it's not. There's no other power. Something. My turn. I'm not. <laughs> they didn't, did they build a single thing? They built a single town. <laughs> Pretty good.
Oh. Nom nom. Oceans away. Clum nom. Not looking, not looking. <laughs> One thing I've kind of been neglecting to do, I'll be honest, is looking at the state of the board. Other than my board. Your turn. All right. I'm going to take a glance at the board just so I know what yeah, I need look to at do. Your, board. your board's awesome. Can't look and see what you played just yet. <laughs> That's cheating. Just imagine what you think they might have played. I'm just gonna click buttons for a moment. <laughs> yeah, there's one card that has the two elements here. There's another card that has the two elements. You're cheating! You're, you're cheating! <laughs> I'm not cheating. I know what elements cards have and what you're looking for. <laughs> I'm done. All right, we're all done. Finish playing cards. Ocean gun ocean. You need Shadows Reach aspect early implemented? I took a look at the aspects. Um, there are so many ones for Shadows. It makes me feel like they're trying to kind of like... Like, it's like how Bunker has five different variants. Because like they keep trying to find a way to fix Bunker. Hmm. Makes me feel like they're trying to do the same with Shadows. They keep trying to find a way to fix Shadows. Yeah. Not that Shadows is broken or bad per se, just um People People less... keep on thinking he's bad. And I don't get why, because Shadows. He's just good shadows. for fear, I... he's good for stopping builds. But he's I think it has a it's really hard early game with Shadows, I think. 
but it ramps up pretty nice. So. Yeah. yeah. He has a really fast, uh, really fast growth in both tracks. Sorry, it has a really fast growth. I hate trying to apply a pronoun to a thing that shouldn't have a pronoun. I guess the pronoun is it. Because that's what the back of the spirit boards say. Is it. Yeah. Nom nom nom. Hum, nom 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 nom. <laughs> Shadows is decent versus not England or France. <laughs> Shadows is great. It's second only to Bringer for generating fear, and it kills stuff. Yeah. Yes. I have all of these things. Five sixths of an energy. And I wish I had sacred sites that were not only there. I'm sorry, I do not understand what you are saying. You are saying it in a language different than I am speaking. <laughs> it matters not, I am not playing green. We don't have invaders in our land. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I'm noticing that. Now. It's what you're trying to figure out there. <laughs> really? I hate it. I hate it a lot. Man, I, it was so much better when it was uh, gain one energy and play an extra card. <laughs> I guess so. That works. Uh, in, yeah, I click one now. I click one now. <laughs> Ooh. Those aren't a thing we have. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Yep. That's a thing. That's a thing. You got all those Terra Mountains handled, dude, right? Sorry, I did not understand the language that you were speaking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, John Land. Sorry. Or ocean is, is that ocean? No, that, ocean. yeah, that's ocean land. 
Then John Land. Then Lude yeah, Land. Lude Land. Shuffle the majors already. I'm sorry, I do not understand the language with which you speak. Our anthem. That's magic. a real question. <laughs> Did we reshuffle the majors already? Wait a minute. <laughs> um. Now I feel like we can interpret everything. Like, okay, so I have a rules question. Say that I play this card here to destroy this city. Would that work? Yes, it would work. That's a dumb question. You're just asking it so that you can communicate your plan with us. Nom nom. <laughs> <laughs> Never not good. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I'm looking at a uh, Discord right now. There is a really terrible joke, but um, it's kind of political, so I probably shouldn't say it. But um, that interview that Trump had recently that has resulted in um the greatest facial reactions by the interviewer um it's turned into a bit of a meme someone has made like a four image comic thing where it's like image one is tic-tac-toe where trump wins by putting a circle outside the box and getting three in a row and the interviewer is like what you can't do that i hate my presence and it's not gonna get better what are you a little child you hate your presence grow up I can never get more than three on the board because of the blade card. <laughs> it's terrifying. Yeah. Uh, you and I both have that problem where at best we put one presence on the board. I have an out, though. You're an out? You're an out. What's, oh, indomitable claim. I claim you... that there's an out that is indomitable. <laughs> yeah. I I'm now want to say John understands why I wanted him to take uh, Blazing Renewal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, John well, said that, there's no destroyed presence. Around. Well, the It'll island is around. blighted now, so... It'll come back around. I needed the other card this turn. That turn. We are in terror level two, right? That's a rules question. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Yes, yes, we, we are. are. How many That's cards are left in at. the fear deck? This is a rules question. <laughs> Sorry? No, how many cards are, we... are there? How many cards are we into? I missed the transition. I think I was busy bathrooming. Uh, I or think maybe we're not. only I one know. into level terror level two. Okay. Yes. It's so pleasant playing difficulty zero for once. I say that after having played difficulty zero last night. Hey, but I, was, I was playing Back. a spirit with super high complexity, like the complexity nom, was listed nom. as very high. I'm not going to say anything except 420. 420 blaze it. Ha 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 ha. 
was a there was a time once when I was dicking around with friends on Discord. When you're the admin of a server, you could or even just a mod, I think, would have this function. You could server deafen someone, but they can still talk, but they can't hear what other people are saying. So I server deafened everyone in the call. And everyone just started saying random crap without knowing what ever, anyone else was saying. I feel like that'd be a fun way to try to play a communicationless Spirit Island game. <laughs> it just wouldn't work well on my end because I'd have to, you know, still share the audio with everyone. Bueno. <laughs> Necesito comenzar mi juego. ¿Cómo estás? <laughs> oh no, you understand Spanish now. <laughs> A little bit from traveling in South America for seven months, a couple of years ago. Got good at saying no habla español or habla poco español. <laughs> I have the not as much Poco at all. Oh, no. John, if yourself and Brittany are ever having, heading Ireland way, give me a shout because I have a spare room if you'd like to stay. Cool. Uh, not anytime soon due to the world. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the <laughs> end of the 2020. world as we know it. Uh, I, I have spent some time in Ireland. We were in Dublin uh, for a month, a few years ago, and did you have a, my sympathies. Uh, a loop around. Went over to, we did basically did a loop of the island uh, over a weekend. Oh God, you didn't get to see much if, you were, if it was only no, a weekend. It was, it was like a three or four day sort of just road loop. Went up to the went, sort of did a farm stay in up in the northwest, and then to the giants. Uh, causeway. causeway yeah and then home from there so yeah mostly so in and around dublin sorry so you saw practically nothing of the country yeah well i mean uh we mostly like to stay in cities so we went to limerick that was fun <laughs> Whereabouts in Ireland are you? Waterford. Okay. So southeast. Uh. Yeah, we didn't make it to any of the southeast because we sort of did a oh, quick road trip. Like barely went south of Dublin. Yeah. Which is, hey, you know, two hey, thirds hey, of the <laughs> All right, would you like to know the fear card first? See. Si. Muy bien. We're definitely getting it. Defend one in the land of a Dahan plus an additional defend one per Dahan. Look at all those lands with Dahan that are getting ravaged. No, no. Yeah, that one. My cards do nothing now. Well, maybe not nothing. I'm going to let other people go first this time. Okay. Uh, can I look and see loot? Quick and see. Oh, yeah. I mean, you go. Yeah, you go. You want to see loot? Hi, I'm a loot. You can see me. I see a loot. I think this is going to do enough. Oh, yes. This. Then click. Do, 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 do. 
than this. Yay! Hey, Gusto. Carry on, Lude. Okay. Carry on, my Ludward son. I have things I can do. In some capacity. Maybe. It's all up to you, Num Num. Wrong, wrong person. Okay. You can hit the undo. What am I doing? That. Yeah, just click randomly, it'll work. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought I clicked to move two into that land, but I clicked one of the ones that have moved in, I guess. I don't know. It's weird. Probably should have moved them to the ball. No sacred feels bad, man. That's me. Lude. Oh my gosh, no way. Oh, what? 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 No, no. <laughs> condition update that's down down below oh town kill town we're going down town quickly click click When you're alone and life is making you sure you can always go downtown. Except I forgot <laughs> one of those words. Town or down? When you're alone and something, 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 you can always go downtown. I'm just not sure what the second part was. I don't know. Yeah. 
I could Google, Google that me. while people are taking turns. That's what I've been doing this game, is just taking my phone out and just, starting to... Uh, just Googling. Just, just Google it. This is a song from Lost. Well, rather, it's a real song that got featured on Lost. Is it not? It's definitely not a song from Lost. I mean, <laughs> it's a song that was played in Lost. <laughs> When you're alone and life is making right. you lonely, you Google. can always go downtown. When you've got worries, all the noise and the hurry seems to help, I know. Downtown, just listen to the music of the traffic in the city. Linger on the sidewalk where the neon signs are pretty. How can you lose? The lights are much brighter there. You can forget all your troubles, forgot all your cares. So go downtown. Things will be great when you're downtown. Okay, I'm done. Thank you for listening to my rendition of the song. <laughs> Welcome to Spirit Island Saturdays, the musical. <laughs> right, I'm done. done. Okay. All right, I'm gonna do a thing and get a thing with a thing. And then thing. Finger. I don't even know what I'm trying to do here. Oh. You. That's me. That's you. Me. <laughs> I got a plan. I got a plan. Or do I? I don't know. I thought I had a plan. I see a plan. See your plan. Uh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> mm. It's not much of a plan after all. Seems good. Sorry, I have to think for a second. Well, you think while I'm clicking things. Okay. You're gesturing, John. <laughs> John is gesturing. That's against the rules. We lose. <laughs> oh, he's not. He's just thinking. He's literally thinking. I clicked the thing. Okay. Yeah, I can make that work, I think. Okay, I'm good. 
Are we good? All right. I'm going to go first since I'm revealing a fear card. Dun, dun, dun. Have a good night. Oh, Frenzy's giving up already. Night, Frenzy. Night, night, Frenzy. <laughs> All the noms. want to go You'll go loot. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, loot, and then see what's left for Ocean after. Uh, no, I don't have any. The rest of my powers is range zero, and, and I'm just in the ocean. So. Quick question: Why are those going in the mountain? Okay. I have three. I have. I have. You know, a plan. So your things don't do anything? Nope. All right. Presents. Year. Ooh. Don't touch D6. <laughs> yeah, no need for jungle. John choose land. Well, John and Lude choose these two lands. <laughs> uh, we have this one next turn anyway. Right. It's not really a good place. Oh yeah, the wetland. Yeah. The jungle dead already. So. from a land without city. John, choose this.
We'll choose this. No explorers. Whatever shall we do? Oh no. I like Bringer's icon actually, now I'm looking at it. It's very uh very scary. Spooky. He's supposed to be spooky. I think there's one city on the board. Yep. In Two. my corner. Oh, I can't do one. anything about it. But ocean can reach. You must gain a power card first. That's me done. I also have. I mean, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm cheating done. now, but I mean, like, I'm done my growth. I haven't been paying attention to how you guys have been growing. I've done all that I need to do. <laughs> Click finish playing cards. I mean, I know, need, I that's know. What you need to do. What? It's Ocean's game to win. Is that what's going on? Ocean goes. Yeah. I also game could over. have done it myself with my far-reaching Dahan abilities. But we'll give it to Ocean. Ocean's great. The moms. <laughs> All right. So now that Ocean did that, here's what could have happened. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Ocean did it better. <laughs> but that was more fear from Ocean, right? It looked like it. It was four versus two. Because it was what? I mean, yes. I could have generated fear. Right. Well, <laughs> if I'd paid attention, I could have removed the blight as well. <laughs> Let's finish the game. The game is over. The game is the over. Game. How's that for a game without much communication? How about that five blight in that one turn, huh? <laughs> I'm sure we could have optimized for a non-blighted island and so on, but that was yeah. pretty good for a quick, <laughs> quick game. I feel like we could have played quicker. Yep. Yeah. Um, just when playing, um, with the basic blight cards, Blazing Renewal is guaranteed to be useful. That's true. Yeah. I was yeah. more concerned with what was going on that turn, so. Yeah. It's all right. fine. That's we still it. won. Clearly, we did all the right things. <laughs> yeah, we won. Yes, indeed. All right. Thank you for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed your stay. This is Handelobber Games. We stream every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday here on Handelobber Games. 
On Tuesday nights, we have uh, Handelabra Live with John and sometimes Jeremy, who like to demo content before it is publicly available. Every Thursday, we have Dolphins Dive with myself, where we like to play games strategically and discuss what we're doing and why it works well and how to win. Uh, every Saturday is Spirit Island Saturdays, where we play Spirit Island with people and sometimes win, sometimes lose. Well, we lost once and won every other time, but <laughs> sometimes we lose. <laughs> And every Sunday is Tales from the Archive with another letdown for some storytelling Sentinels. Sentinels of the Multiverse, One Deck Dungeon, Bottom of the Ninth, and Aeon's End are available on Steam, iOS, and Android devices. Spirit Island is available on Steam and will be available for iOS and Android devices later this year, I believe, so you can check that out once it's released. But um, you can find more information on those games at handelabra.com. You can find me on Twitter at LewDolphin21. You can find me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash LewDolphin. You can find John on Twitch at twitch.tv slash P. He sometimes plays Slays the, Slay the Spire. Not Slays the Spire, but Slay the Spire. Sometimes I slay the Spire. <laughs> sometimes the spire, spire slays me. Usually it slays you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and Seamus Butler is Seamus Butler on Twitch, but I don't know if he streams. I don't, I don't believe so. Not yet. Not yet. Soon. Yeah. Cool. But for those who have watched the past, you know, three weeks of streaming with Seamus Butler as the guest, you might notice that he sounds a lot better to this week because he actually has it's a real mic for once. Shiny new mic. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Uh, so yeah, thanks again, Seamus, for joining us. Uh, Ooh, and if you, like yeah, if anyone out there wants to join, you can redeem your point Labras at the bottom of the Twitch chat to also, I mean, Seamus has had a lot of points. <laughs> <laughs> a very faithful viewer I'm paced it's decay it's going to be I might get enough to be here next week again by uh, by uh, Thursday we'll find out <laughs> if not the week after <laughs> but alright thank you for joining us Seamus and um, thank you for joining me John I guess I don't know Thank you for always being here, a thorn in my side. <laughs> Cue the Golden Girls theme. <laughs> you can't but, be uh, a thorn in your side. You don't have the um, Keeper of Forgotten Wilds yet. True. <laughs> no, that's when he becomes a thorn in your side. You don't have the thorns yet. <laughs> Thank you, Ken. Yeah. Just wait until we get uh, the wildfire, too. I'll just be throwing blight like you wouldn't Ooh. believe. Wildfire is so much fun to play with, even though I don't actually use them. So much for your <laughs> score. <laughs> yeah. Score is relevant. <laughs> Welcome to Spirit Island, where everything's made up and the points don't matter. Exactly. <laughs> but all right, have a good night, everyone. Stay safe, and we'll see you next time. Good night. Night-night. Oh, no.